CGC right now? Oh, uh, CCG is running the tournament and Hobbies and Moors too. What the hell? They all want a remote duel? Shit. Well, it's a little Demystic bit. Mystic Mind and Skill Drain someone, you. Disgusting. Top tier gameplay. Alrighty. I can get this chat. Oh, I need to get my chat out. Let me start the song. Are you streaming again? Yeah, I'm streaming again. Kind of. Jonathan, have you downloaded Python yet? No. Oh, okay. Yet. You should do that when you get the chance. I can right. teach you how to run these tournaments so I don't have to. <laughs> what a lazy man. Isn't that the whole point of being president? Do you make go? other people do your shit? <laughs> so, there is some truth to that, I will say. Okay. Andrew, Tiger. Oh. Why did this not work? Yishan, me, Kanyos. Usually this works. What happened? Jonathan is where? Oh. JJ0822. Andrew, Tiger, you found uh, me, Tanya, and Jonathan. Oh, it does oh I forgot the. Uh, okay. Chill. We are chilling. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven people. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. That's pretty good. So file. Save. Okay. Ready to go then. And with that, I'll run the software. Enter Andrew Tiger Yushan. Go spectate some people. Oh, Andrew got the buy. Did the uh, timer already start? Um, I'll start the timer real quick and then I'll post the pairings. <clears throat> <laughs> 45 edits view <laughs> stun is beating up on drytron at the top tables of dueling book <laughs> you he just has you, two barrier you, statues you. <laughs> and he's just whacking this dude i wouldn't play the wind barrier statue though right now i'd play a different one maybe like fire or something what is the wind barrier? Hey, we could Goomba. Well, because, like, there's Virtual World. Virtual World, Drytron oh, are the, two, the top two decks. You don't really want to play the Light Barrier statue. You can play Water. Water's not bad. Water or Fire, it seems like right now, that's the two statues you'd want to play. Yeah. Alright, round one pairings are up in the lecture. Hello? Round one pairings Hello? are up. Oh, Jorge! Long time no see. Oh, it's Jorge. I'm against Yishan. Oh my. Uh, what table are we at, Leon? The image is not loading for me for some reason. Yishan, your table one. Oh, we're table one? Uh, exact, uh, uh, you know, it's what I would expect. I told my program to put me there. Hey, Leon, how's it going? I'm doing good. What, what is the major purpose of the structure that the arrow is pointing to? What? I'm doing biology. Oh, 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 oh. Some, some schoolwork or something? Yeah, helping my mom. I am definitely guessing now. No, I'm not guessing. Let's play this today. Try this out. Hello, what deck are you playing today? I'm playing this deck, Jorge, as you can see. 
as you can see on stream. Um, um, two out of three, right? Yep, two out of, well, you can just, oh, are you making the room? It's, it's, you can make it a single, too. You can just offer rematch, but it's fine. No, no, no. I'll make it. I'll AOA, Chola only, that's you, right, I think. Yeah. All right, let's do it, then. I don't know my Haji, man. I really don't. Uh, okay. Oh, I won rock, paper, scissors. Excellent. You're on stream, by the way, Leon. Don't say anything too crazy. Oh, I am? You're streaming me? Alright, let's start with this guy. Still not playing Grand Maji? No, I'm, I'm practicing this deck, because I think I'll play it at the Invitational. Is this one okay, good sir? All good, man. All good. All good in the hood, he says. Okay, I'm gonna believe you then, Leon. Definitely, man. Oh my god, what is this? This is my spicy... It's not, it's, I didn't even invent this deck. My friend showed it to me. Kyle showed it to me. You can check out the answers on the notes. Special this deed out. And activate the effect. All good. Okay, in that case, I'll special this dude out. Activate his effect. All good. I'm gonna grab one of these. What is this deck? Lysolic. Tri Brigade? Lyra Tri Brigade, yeah. Lyra Lust Tri Brigade. This deck. Uh. I'll activate this guy's effect. You can add one, level one. That's fine. Let's add this. Add a DD Crow. Uh. Activate this guy's effect. Okay. Don't forget Fridge Effect. I'm not gonna forget. The refrigerator's effect this time. Bro, they're backseat dueling, hello? <laughs> True. Judge? True. Alright, I'll use Nerval effect. Vanishing two. Is that, is that okay? Yeah, all good, man. All good. Oh, you, I, I didn't. I don't know if you meant like you have no hand traps or like. All good, man. I can't reveal that public private knowledge. Yeah. Look at you, a judge till the end. Of course, man. Suspended, but still a judge. <laughs> okay, let's go. Chain link one, refrigerator. Chain link two, Nerval. Refrigerator. Okay. Yeah. What's refrigerator the link to? Yeah, that's link to. I call it the refrigerator. Uh, so Nerval, I'll add this. And then I'll draw a card with the refrigerator. Let's do this. Okay. This has three counters. I'll use the effect banishing. Or let's do this first, actually. And then I'll use the effect banishing. One, two, three. Grab out sim work. And end phase, some morgue effect, special out, this guy. Oh, oh my, that's all I can see. The opponent cannot target this card. Yeah, you can target the uh, the statue still. You just can't target the some morgue. 
The one sad thing about this this configuration is that the Samora doesn't protect the statue, but. Huh. Hey, what's up, Alex? Damn, I had a good hand. And I just died to Barrier. Yeah, Barrier statue is kind of OP, to be honest. Does your deck search, does your deck search a lot? From what I saw. <laughs> Are you trying to drill me? It drills decent. Oh, drills decent. Keep asking. It drills. <laughs> drills. Been out for so long, man. Drills decent, bro. Don't worry. Drills decent. Don't worry. You won't face this deck very much, to be honest. Drill is good. Drill is good. Um, are you playing Lyrilus Trigates for the International? I'm planning on it. I'm planning on it. I have no clue what you're playing. Keep or do that way, please. Or do I? I don't know. Or do I know? I don't think you know, man. I mean, unless you're playing, maybe you're playing the same deck. What same deck? That you were just playing. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, okay. I'm gonna say if you say so. One, two. I need to side out two more cards. Should I side out? Like this. Uh, and, oh no. Maybe this. Side out one of these, I guess. Oh, you're streaming, right? I can check your stream right now. Yeah, if you want a ghost, I can't stop you. <laughs> I can't stop you. That is not good integrity. Uh, thinking. Interesting hand for me. It's sick. It's your main, Alex. That's pretty cool. Oh, look, it's Ed. I didn't even notice Ed was here. Hey, Ed, how's it going? Chamber Dragon Maid. You can add one Dragon Maid spell or trap from your deck to your... Is this the best one? I think so. Alright, then I'll, I'll do this. I hope you didn't lie to me. Leon. I would never lie to you, my man. Yes, you would. Remember that one time you said you didn't have something, but then you had... You had Wait, what, what, is, what is this? Oh, whoops. Oh, Hello? I don't have what? this. I don't have that in my hand. I have. Uh, yeah. You didn't see that. You didn't see that. Okay. You did not see that. Debatable. Debatable. Oh no, that's pretty good actually. Did not expect that. I didn't expect that either. Uh, chain link one, striker. Chain link two, white. Yep. All right, I'm thinking on resolution here. Okay, what are you gonna do? You gonna draw me? You gonna draw me, punk? <laughs> hmm. Dude, just draw me. You know you want to. I'm th I'm thinking, bro. I'm thinking, bro. bro. You're gonna draw me regardless. Come on. I'm thinking, bro. 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 I'm thinking. Okay, so you have a boot sector launch. Link cross yeah. is banned. Link cross. That's what you think. It is banned. So I think I need to. I'm gonna try this. I'll I'll hit the white dragon. And pray to God. I'm praying to the the holy Lord here. Huh. Well, my guy. Were my prayers? Were my prayers answered? Maybe. Uh, effect is special? Yep. Maybe not. Depends. That's a wind, okay. We take those. That's not a light. <laughs> so I can special it now under barrier statue, you know? <laughs> True, you can special this under barrier statue. That is good. That is good. Okay. It's not quite what I was... Oh. Effect. Paying cost first. Yep. You're good. Oh, this is good? Yeah, yeah, Hello? you're good. You're good. Oh, you're my good. God. Thank you, my dear man. Ugh. Ugh. I'm playing in Core TCG, which I, I don't know what group that is. Core TCG? It's That's in Group B or C or A. I don't, I don't know the number. I don't, I don't know anymore, man. Yeah, I don't know either. It's okay, right, though. Uh, effect destroy for 25. 
Oh, you're gonna you're gonna destroy my driver? Okay, okay. Uh, kill you for one thousand. All right, all right. I need some good cards off the top, baby. I need some good cards. Interesting. Bro, I'll let you have your driver. I have no fear. Unless you kaiju me, then that's a problem. Thank you. All right, effect. Dragoon burning is nasty. Yeah, some pe sometimes he's he. Leon was a little greedy though. That's he funny. burned me for twenty five. That's a little risky. A little That's risky, funny. but hey. Hey, we take those. Take those. Effect. Uh, you can send send this card from your hand. Send one. Okay, that's fine. It's all good in the hood. It's all good in the hood, bro. I wish you were playing your your signature deck, but you know. Okay, I will activate Nerval. You can banish any from your. Uh, the second effect. If That's it's sent to the graveyard, fine. it's That's fine. Let's search out. Mister. Mister. Who should who, who which? Who should I search out here? Mr. Karras. Mr. Karras. We'll search out Karras. Karras! Okay. Um, in that case, uh, what should I do here? Should I do bing or should I do bang or should I do boom? Bingo bangle? Bing bang or boom? It's hard to say. I, I kind of want to keep this. You know, that DD card was really nasty. I bet your chat told you to put it in. <laughs> no, that was my own play. Well, if it, if it was the other way around, because there are a lot more darks than there are lights, right? So like, it's harder to get. It's harder to get a light in the graveyard. So I was like, I'm just gonna banish that then. Okay. Um. All right. Let me think here. I gotta discard something to special this guy. The question is, what this or this? I think we discard this. I should just play Shadal today. <laughs> Discarding that to. Uh, or I, re I guess I reveal this because it's an activated effect to special. You can banish any number, blah, blah, blah. So if I kill that right now, you're on a minus two, right? So then you can use each effect. Uh, I guess I'll negate it with Dragoon. Okay. But then I will normal summon this guy. Kinka bio, okay. I should put him over here. Dude, uh, target the um Nerval. Kinka bio Mystic Piper lock. <laughs> Dude, uh, nah, this card's pretty good. This card's pretty good in this deck. I like it at least. Alright, so let's special summon out to Mr. Nerv. Nerval. Right, so we know the last card is Black Dragon, or the one of the dragons, yeah, Black Dragon, okay. In that case, let's do the old... You still don't have a light in here? Good for me, I guess. Who said I need a, a light? Um... No, Alright, I will... Well, I think I think you do to summon it. You kind of have to have one, right? You're right. You're not wrong. You're right. I'll banish four here. Oh, wait, four. Oh yeah, four. Okay, sure. Mm -hmm. So in this guy. What? The, wait. Wait a minute. Uh huh. The special uh, you can banish one card in the field. Yeah. So I'll banish the dragoon. Oh, See, I don't, I don't know what the deck does. I can't do anything. Yeah, it's tough here. Um, okay, let's see then. I think they rigged the pairings, man. <laughs> you think they rigged it? Yeah, yeah maybe. It. Yeah, maybe. I guess, do I want uh, a Samorg link or do I want something else i don't know i don't know what i want oh i probably could have gotten you no want to go to game three with leon that's what you want you want to go to game three let's grab this guy 
Oh, so that's a bear statue, right? <laughs> yeah, I wonder what it is. But I already normal summon this turn, so... Unlucky or unskilled? Unlucky. Uh, I guess I know that you don't have Ghost Ogre in your hand. So I'm gonna use the effect to gain attack, which I don't usually do. That's fine. 300 attack and defense, crazy. Okay. I'll activate the effect. Okay. And search for... Another DD Crow. Yo, yo, chill, chill. Leave my DD... Leave my graveyard alone. Attack for 600. Isn't it 300? Oh, for each yeah. material, yeah, for each material. On activation? No, it's when it's summoned. It's when it's summoned, it gains 300. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Woohoo. You know... I drew the one out, but then you have this thing. <laughs> what could you have drawn? Another another dragon maid? You the light. Fun. Let's play again. You wanna play again? Okay, let's play again. Uh, let me change my record here for the stream. Have you thought of playing Harpy Feather Storm, the trap card? It seems kind of bad because you have Appaloosa already, right? Well, it's not like it's decent, I guess. That's the one where your opponent can't activate monster effects, right? I needed that Karis off the top, though. I needed that tanky because I didn't have enough through one negate without that. Seems okay, but I think isn't Judgment and Imperial Order just better than that card? Because you're you're worried about like the, the spells, right? Hmm. I'm I'm playing the going first deck and I'm losing die rolls. Can't be doing that. Can't be doing that. Effect. That's fine. Uh, I'll grab this. Effect. You can activate it from the hand, it's the main upside. Although, if you're going first, A, B, or C, I forget. What, what am I in again? Okay, uh, sorry, is Karis good? Or Fractal, I mean? All good, man, all good. No hand traps. No hand traps once again. What am I going to go with this time, though? His hand's not as good as the last one. Hmm. Mine was pretty good. What do you mean? Try to search. That kind of blows, though. Now, like, this hand's actually pretty... bad. But I don't know what to do about it. Let's see. If I send... What can I send here? Hand's a little awkward. I guess I should just go for that. That I should just go for standard double dragon lords play. Yeah, let's just do that. Okay. Um, I will send Nerval and an effect of Nerval to add something. Is that good? Yeah, I'd like to go back to my statement of no hand traps. Okay, okay. I thought, I thought you said you wouldn't be the kind of person to reveal public. In a real match, yes. Yes, okay, okay, okay. Um, so this, this, then, right? Yeah, I'll grab this. Finish two for... The conductor. Hell yeah, man. Dude, what do you think about Shadal Invoked Zoo? 
Well, I think about Shadal invoked. You're in group D or group G. Oh, nice, nice. Uh, I feel like you're competing for a normal summon there. It is, but you know, you bait up the normal summon, then you then you activate Shadal Future from hand. <laughs> that's just that's just me though, man. All right, I will grab this guy. Please don't be a very statue, I swear to God. Okay. Oh, what? Wait, what is this? This is another one. This one can probably protect the barrier statue if I don't open the other combo. Okay. Oh, to send a card, right? Yeah, send and bounce a card, basically. You can special. You special that end phase, right? With whose effect? Samorg, yeah. During the end phase, you special one wing beast monster. That's a wing beast? Oh my god. <laughs> What the fuck? Emo certainly is a winged beast. You can, add, you can send one card from your hand or graveyard to the field. Turn to the hand. Group G? Well, good luck. Hey, top 16, there's an invoked mat. A lot of people seem to want that invoked mat. Okay. Entering battle phase. Uh huh. I'd like to attack the bear statue, please. Alright, I'll use this. Alright, I'm gonna bounce with my hand. I, I completely understand. I will end my turn. <laughs> <laughs> I can't, can't do anything. Yeah, that's why this deck is good. It's good against Drytron and, and that. If you can combo off and get the statue, you get statue plus protection. Plus follow up for next turn. So. Is this good again? No, that can't be good again. Oh, maybe it is though. It's Dragon Maid. I don't know, is Lancia good against Dragon Maid? Or is it bad? Uh, yeah, it stops the Dragon Lynx and then... It just stops the Dragon Lynx? It doesn't really... It only stops White and Black Dragon. Oh, which yeah, I guess that's is... The whole, that's, that's the whole point, because then that's... Um... That is true, that's pretty good. But all my cards are grave effects and on-field effects. Yeah, it's only... Oh, it seems like okay. Not the greatest. Um, uh, take this out. Take I mean, this you out. You saw my normal summon. You're pretty much golden. Well, that's what I that's what I hoped last game, but it didn't quite work out. I mean, the rest of the question is, do I side in more hand traps? It could be a little risky, to be honest. Mm -hmm. I want that invoked, Matt. <laughs> a lot of people do want that. Alright, I think I can try to play now, hopefully. Effect? Mm hmm Jump? Yep. Parlor Dragon Maid. Sex uh, change. Yeah, exchange over effect and grace. Target one dragon monster control, add this card to your hand, and if you do, return the monster to the hand. Okay. This one's pretty broken. Yep, that's good. Summoning Dragon Mage Shio. Okay. Also have to return this in special summon one. Okay. Interesting. Can I say Shiro effect? Oh yeah. Sorry, yeah. And that effect of chamber to add a floor trap. Yep. That's good. All you. Okay, I will. Activate Tinky. Um, that's fine. 
Let's grab. And then effect. That's good. Um, let's send this guy. Okay, effect of this guy. Nerval. That's fine. Let's grab. Huh. Normal summon. Normal is fine. Okay, I will activate the effect. Uh, activating cheer roll. Uh huh. Destroys it, right? Yeah, it destroys it. Uh, uh, shiitake mushrooms. Which browser would you recommend use Doom Pokemon? I like Google Chrome, but some people say they don't they don't, they don't like it for them. I like it. I like a Why do you run both? Phone. I find that they both of them come up and and like a lot of times in the grind game, you want to have the Apex Avion. Um, well, I'm sort of in a bit of a pickle here. I think I'm fucked, is actually what I'm trying to say. <laughs> I think I'm fucked, that's what I'm trying to say. Alright, let's put in this guy, this guy, this guy, this guy, this guy. These other petrol come in. Like, I, I, actually, I even don't think it's a brick, because as long, anything that's a winged beast is not a brick, basically. Any time, anything that's a tri-beast type is not a brick, which is kind of nice. Um, what should I take out here? I guess this. So I want to side in something. Keep one of these in then. Yes. Try to go first, see if we can do the same thing that we did the first game. Effect. All good, my guy. All good. All good. Yeah. Effect. Add this one. This. This one, this guy. I guess I could have summoned something else, actually. Uh, whatever. Summon this guy. And banish these two. Oh, let's see. How many summons is that? <sighs> you have Nibiru? <laughs> Shit, I was like, maybe I should try to play around Nibiru. <laughs> this is this is five. This is five. 
<laughs> but right, yeah, 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 I'm not gonna take that chance, man. I'm just gonna declare it. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Fuck, I was like, shit, maybe I should play around the beer, bro. Oh my god, dude. Fuck me. Actually, did I have a way to play around the beer there? I don't really think. The brew. If I could go... This is... Because summoning this is three... Huh. Which group are you in? I don't, I, don't, I don't know. Which group is Core TCG? I'm in Core TCG, that's all I know. Um, interesting, because I played. Oh shit! Are they waiting for us? I better report. I think I think we reported, didn't we? Did I report? I didn't report. Oh, well, you can't. Okay, I'm just gonna say that I got it before they get mad at us for not reporting. Um, interesting. Well, yeah, there's no way to make statue plus protection under five. I don't know what the right thing to do is. I had this though. Is there a way to make statue plus protection under five? All right, sorry. Let me think about this here. I mean, you have position, maybe. I'm just wondering if there's a way because I could have normaled D Crow made Link Karibo. One, two, but that's still two summons. That's four actually. Interesting. I wonder if that's like a interesting play. Um, all right. I could have went normal DD Crow, link it off to Link Karibo, discard something special, Karis, Karis banish three for some more. That would have been. That's good. Oh my god, this is the one card dragon combo. <laughs> You, sir? Suck a dick. I'm just kidding. Um, uh, that hurt. Dang, I really missed the Lyra Lusks, though. The Lyra Lusks help you play around Nibiru, which sucks. Dragon Link. This is, this is Dragon I'm just playing my... We're, we're, we finished our tournament match. We're playing another one. Ravine. That's fine. Mm -hmm. Yep. The fuck, you're discarding a quick launch? What the hell? Okay. Bro, is that good, man? Is that good? Yeah, it's all that's good. It's good. It's all good in the hood. All it's right. all good in the hood. All right, man. Make oh. sure. I will see. You on. Uh, okay. I'm thinking here. So if I let this resolve, I'm gonna lose, right? If you have a normal summon, then you have a normal summon. I can't do much about that. Oh wait, no, that's Black Dragon. Fuck. Fuck. Minus one. Fuck. This can send a spell, though. All right, you know what? I'm just gonna hope you set it out your your dragoon engine. All right, let's. You set it out your dragoon engine, right? Going second. Oh yeah, I definitely did. Yeah. Uh, what's the defense of your monster? Let's see. It should be fifteen hundred. Yeah, it's fifteen hundred. I mean, if I don't judgment this, then I'm gonna lose either way, I feel like. Oh shit, you did? Seriously? Yeah, I did. I did. Okay. Oh, wow, oh, I actually, okay, I actually have a chance. You're telling me I have a chance here. What can I draw? It's it. A... Uh, I guess. Honestly, nothing, to be honest. I probably still lose. But we'll give it a shot. Oh, okay, that's the that's a start here. Is there any possible way to win this game? I'm gonna fucking try. I'm gonna fucking try. I probably used both my interruption ones. Alright, tanky for fractal. Do I send fractal or, or not? You you topic a tanky. I have four already, so maybe I don't send anything. All right, maybe I just normal it and then send. But then if I normal it, now I have to link. Yeah, Fractal can send itself. Yeah, I know from fields, but 
Okay, I have to add fractals, so there's no thinking here. I, I, that's the only target in my deck. I don't, I don't know that. Um, oh, but yeah, then yeah. do I send for Nerval or not? If I send for Nerval, Nerval will search something else. If I don't send for Nerval... Oh, I don't fucking know. And I can send it later, but then I don't have a normal summon anymore. I'm gonna have to link. I mean, I guess I get another fractal, normal fractal effect. Search. I mean, it doesn't really matter, I don't think. I need to send... Alright. Yeah, I think I yeah, I think you're right. I have to make fridge. I have to make refrigerator first. That's the only way. The variety of Yeah, I think I have to make refrigerator first. That's the only way. So I definitely normal this. Yeah. I can't just go straight into the link four. I have to be patient here. So this into this. Ah, uh, but I really want to send the link, but there's no choice, right? Okay. Effect of fractal. Yeah. It's a little sad, but whatever. And then effective Nerval. Yeah, it's a little sad, but it's not the worst. Could be worse. Effect of the refrigerator. Special summon this guy out. Now I can make the link four, then make the link three. Maybe that's the play. Link four, then link three. And then I have an interruption on your turn. Uh, what, what number summon is that? Uh, you don't have a Nibiru in your hand, so I'm chilling. Are you sure? <laughs> yeah, it's the fucking black dragon, bro. <laughs> what do you think? I'm stupid. <laughs> You're fucking. <laughs> it's the fucking black dragon, bro. I remember. <laughs> Good, good, good. All right, all right. Just making sure. Okay, okay. Just double checking. I see. Just double checking. Okay. Dude, you're a YCS champ. Man, I gotta make sure you're running. Sorry, runner up. Runner up. Runner up. Exactly. Okay. Now, ah, uh, but I, I can't. I have to banish Nibiru. I can't banish Ravine. Oh, uh, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Ravine's trash. Card's trash anyway. So we make this thing. We make another. Okay, so you're gonna banish? I should have summoned this in attack. Alright, summon this in attack. You gonna summon Banish Nibiru? Yeah, I banished Nibiru. Okay. And then attack, 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 attack. 28, 58. Wait, 58. I guess there might have been a, an access code play here, but whatever. Whatever. Okay. Alright. Can any of them end on my turn? Not yet. Not yet. So are you gonna draw one and put one back to the bottom? Yeah, I'll draw one and put one to the bottom. <laughs> what the? <laughs> your gonna say is you can touch one of those and then the attack off the uh, Okay. Okay, so I will. Pup, 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 pup. Pass turn? Pass to you, yeah. Okay, so only this thing can do in my turn, right? Well, he's only quick effect. Let's put it that way. Oh yeah, she gives you all your cards now, right? Um, what does my grave? Oh, I can. All right, banish your cost first to summon. I only have one hope here. All right, is that good, my guy? No, it's not. I'll activate this. Okay. I'll special back. Who should I special back? Actually, I never thought about this. Graveyard two. Wait, anything? 
Uh, it has to be a tri beast, level four or lower tri beast. Oh wait, yeah. then I have to summon Karis. Never mind. Yeah. And then effective this one. You can vanish on the field. I'll ban. I'll banish this. Okay, now I need your chaos space to be bad. Please help me. Help me. I think I <gasps> My heart. Oh, Broski, it's over. What? Fuck, bro. Oh my god, bro. Fuck this shit, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck this shit, bro. And then... Let's see. Do I have a Twitch? I I'm thinking about trying to stream to Twitch as well. I have like a following on YouTube, so I don't really stream to Twitch, but I'm thinking about doing both. I do have a Twitch. No, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. I'm still in this, right? It's not like over for me, I think. Let's see, what can I do? What can I do? What can this one's sent. Oh, this goes to my hand. I didn't know my yet, right? Yeah, I didn't know my yet. Uh, let me check. What, what can I send? It's not over, over. That's what you think. Oh my god, what do I send? To be fair, no, they usually make Striker Dragon right away. Oh no, he wouldn't. You would no, you would have sent back. You're right. He would have sent back. Actually, that's a good point. I guess because he, right, so yeah, you would have Chaos based first, right? What is what's going on here? Oh no no. So after the whole chain resolved, right? Oh oh, oh this sends. Oh this oh this also sends. What the hell? Oh I forgot. This card's the best. Okay. Ishan, what's your opinion on Forbidden Droplet and Triple Attack as talent? It's good against this deck, that's for sure. No, it's not. <laughs> Forbidden Droplet is good against my deck. Yeah, it is. Alright, yeah, you're good, you're good. I mean, I'm not, I haven't lost this game yet. It's not over. It was a good top deck, but I still have a chance. Sex change is here, okay. Change. Mm -hmm. And... And special and attack. 2700, okay. Okay, so let's see. If this card's in the grave, make all your monsters again and lose. So this this is negated, right? Forever? Well, it's gonna go to my hand during the end phase. Okay, okay. God, is it worth buying? No. If you, it depends on what you're playing, I guess. But I, I mean, it's really up to you. It, it, like, it's a good card, so like. I can't really say it's not worth buying. It's not like buying like three thousand dollar Dark Magician girls. No. Oh my God! Uh, attack this thing for four hundred. Uh, yeah, I guess you lose six hundred attack. Yeah. Doesn't really matter though. But okay. Just gonna fuse it away, right? Yeah, I'm gonna fuse it away, and then end, and then end of battle. Dragon thing. Mm hmm. You can send any dragons from your hand and have the same number. Shio. Okay. Has a negate plus its specials, which is kind of annoying, but. Let's see, what can I do? What can I do? This is a card in my hand. I can do, I can do that and then do that. Well, let's, let's play in that. You know, so normal summon? Oh, oh, okay. Okay, but you don't have three lights or darks at least, so I'm not like fucking That's absolute. What do you think? Uh oh. No. <laughs> I'm trolling you, trolling. Oh, okay. I was about to say, bro. I'm like, what the hell? How do you about to get three lights or darks in here? Hand or graveyard? Okay. Wait, you can. You can vanish this card from your game or target one level. Okay. 
standby phase. Oh, sorry, this goes in my hand. I forgot. Then effect. Mm hmm. Hmm. I'm gambling on this play right now. I don't know what to do here. If I normal, you banish. If I <sighs> and this shit fucking blows. All right, all right. Uh, what can I do here? What can I do? This is a long, long journey. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be a long one, bro. It's gonna be a long one. All right, let's. Oh, this. Um, it's. Activate this. You can discard to bend. Um, you can't use the graveyard effect, right? Which one? The one that you just revealed. I, I can use both in the same turn. The banish? Yeah, the banish. Yeah, I can use both in the same turn. Oh, that's fine then. Totally fine. Continue. Okay. Effect. Yep. Yeah, I have to, man. I have to. This is math, then. Oh, hello there. Oh, shit. Everyone's here. We finished, by the way, just so that you guys don't know. Don't wait. Don't have the whole tournament wait on us. Okay. Uh, Shrag no, effect to search. Um, that's fine. Um, okay, there I must have. These things don't bounce once per turn during the standby phase. When another phase, except when the oh my god, bro, you can target one monster your opponent controls. Bro, it's an omni pop. An omni pop, bro. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this shit's so stupid, dude. <laughs> Fuck. You're like a with various statues. What is this? Shit's so dumb, bro. Shit's so dumb. Um. You want to lead on me, Sean? No, I fire don't. For 10, right? Call two. Set a grand manju. And then they, they attack into it. That's stupid. Because so I have to do this. I have to make like a four material Appaloosa here, I think. It's my only chance. Can you? Well, I have to search something here, but I don't even know what to search. I guess I can search... Nerval? Uh... I don't know. Hey man, take all the time you need. <laughs> I need a lot of time. Oh, uh, if I had like Zoo King Alpha in my deck, this would actually be a good time to search that. I don't. I, in fact, do not have that card in my deck. I could search King of Bayou. Maybe I have to search King of Bayou here. King of Bayou? Make the Zeus. Zeus hopefully is good enough. Is it the start the of the battle phase? I guess. What should I do with this card, though? Karis, like, I feel like it's easy. Ooh! I can make that... And this... I don't fucking know what hello? I'm doing, hello? dude. Yeah, hello? Hello, hello. Yeah. Oh, really? The next round pairings are up. I don't know what yeah. you guys. Uh oh. Uh, okay. Oh, Donovan, I, I realized the amount of life you had left is the exact amount as the access code game you got. All right, well, I don't know who oh. would have won this one. I would have been close. Why well, don't I, I, I could make Zeus with the fucking the bird that can't be destroyed by card effects. Okay. And then, I don't know, it was interesting. 
Yeah. Round two pairing, Leon versus Tiger. Okay. All right, good luck. Next round. Good luck. All right, all right. Yishan and Tanya is right here. Okay, okay. All right, Tanya, so I'm ready. Should I make it? I'll make it, I guess. Okay. Two out of, oops. Whatever. Oh, okay. Two out of three match, okay. Do you know if if the monster Natasha targets to gain life, uh, goes to grave before the effect resolves? Does it? Does he still? Do you still gain the life or not? Uh, let me see. Because it gains life equal to half its attack. Probably not, is my original guess. Well, let me see. You can ritual summon blah 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 blah. Once per turn, you can target one face of monster you control. Gain life points equal to half its attack. Nah, no, yeah, I think you'd have to. I think it has to be face up. Or it has to be the same monster. The monster. Feel better Because <laughs> like, because like, you could change the attack, right? And then right. it would still gain e LP equal to half. So it's obviously it's not. Obviously it's not um done on yeah. So you should be yeah. You should be. Yeah, able, we weren't should. we weren't sure, and so I won in time. But if he didn't gain those lives, then I would have just uh, one killed. Right so. It didn't matter in the end, but just wanted to. Yeah, don't let those Drytron players cheat you. Never let those Drytron <laughs> players cheat you, bro. Oh, Seth. Okay, okay, here we go. The class. <laughs> here we go, boys. Let's get started. <laughs> Let's get started, boys. Let's get started. I probably shouldn't have set one of these. <laughs> um... Should have been smarter. Three sets, huh? Yeah. It's your lucky day. It's time for some jack in the hand. Oh no. <laughs> uh, adds the hand. Jorge says hi, by the way. Tell him I say hi as well. Alright. Hello, Jorge. We have three level one monsters, different names from your deck. Add you I choose one to add to your hand. Okay. You choose one yeah, for you you choose one for yourself, and then I choose one from the remaining two. Well, I can add all my cards here to, to your hand. Okay, yeah, sure. Uh, let's see here. What am I gonna pick? What am I gonna this pick? It's insane. It's good. It's good. Good. I'm not gonna lie. It's good. Okay. It's not. No, it's not that good though. It's not that good. It's not insane. Okay. So I guess I choose. Which Pokemon will you choose? I choose you. If this card is sent to the grave, you can add a Tri Brigade. I know that one. I'll give you. No, no, no. Like I said, people misunderstand this card. You pick one to add to your hand, and then I pick from the remaining two. Oh, I get to take one. Yes, you pick I one to add it. to your hand. Yeah. Oh, I thought you got to add two, and I was like, wow, this card's absolutely crazy. And then the other one goes back into the deck. Yeah, people misunderstand this card a lot. Okay, then I guess I take Nerval. Uh, actually, I'll take the Turquoise, dude. Take the Turquoise? Okay, let me think on what I want then. I'm going to go with this one. Okay. Okay, let's do this. One for one is a good card, yeah. Okay. Okay, so... Go chain link one Nerval chain link two cobalt. Yeah. What kind of deck are you playing today, Tanya? What kind of deck That's are you a good playing? Good question. What kind of deck do we have here? Okay. Um. So, would I say chain link two turquoise or cobalt? I mean. 
I think he said chain to cobalt. Okay, let's add this. I mean, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter that much. And let's add... This. Hmm. Okay. Reveal this sapphire swallow. Yeah. That's fine. Okay, let's go here. And this will summon out this, I guess. Oh, DD Crow. The old DD Crow is coming out. Um, what should I do next then? Great question. I guess I'm gonna overlay some cards together. Uh, detach one, add one wing beast. You didn't normal summon yet, right? I haven't normal summoned, yeah. Dang. Um, I'm patient. I'm patient, telling you. What patient man, what can I say? Yeah, the summon is fine. Alright, I will activate the effect then. Four cards in hand, one is Karas, one is Kinka. Okay, so the normal one is going to be for Kinka, probably. Okay, oh, whoops, I'll just use this. Okay. Tanya's, whenever I play you, seem to have this card against me. I do. It's okay, though. It's okay. Every time I don't play you, I always have uh, this card. <laughs> in my hand. Um, okay, let's see. What's next, then? Hmm. Let's go. Um, I'll use the effect to target Nerval. Target Nerval? Is this thing once per turn to add? Yeah, okay. Uh, that's fine. Hmm. I wish I had some interesting cards, but I don't. What's the link three wind uh, Samorg? Oh, I never read. Actually, I just remembered its name. Samorg Bird of Divinity or something like that? Yeah, I just wanted to know <laughs> what our type it was. <laughs> okay, um... I'm going to overlay these. Into this. Into that one? Uh, yeah, this one's just going to attack, right? As 400 attack? 400 attack, yeah. Okay, and attacks direct. Yep. Okay, yeah, that's fine. I'm going to activate the effect. To make it so Lyrilusk monsters you control cannot be destroyed by battle or card effects. Okay, cool. Yep. Um, okay, and then I'm going to activate Nerval. Okay. Four. Cool. This card. This card is special summoned, or if another beast when beast is special summoned, you can banish one card on the field. Okay. So I'll activate the effect. Uh, it's... Hmm. Yeah. 
Yeah, effect is fine. Okay, so I will banish. I need some RNG, maybe. The <laughs> Not the gamma. <laughs> I'll banish this. Okay. Uh, and Paleozoic Dynamiscus. Okay. Very interesting indeed. Okay. All right, let's go battle then. Or I try attempt to enter yeah. battle. Sorry. Uh, battle. Battle phase is good. Okay. Yeah, that's uh four hundred and eight hundred. Uh, it's just four hundred, I think. Oh, oh actually, it's only, only actually it's only it's only two hundred. Okay. Yeah, only two hundred. So sorry, only only no, only two hundred. Only two hundred. It only has one material, so only two hundred. Yeah, but you attack twice, right? No, but I can only attack once, actually, because it's uh, it can attack oh, up yeah, to yeah. number. Yeah, I already detached before I attacked. Okay. A hundred, a hundred more. There you go. All right, main phase two. Yeah. Oh, Zeus, I forgot this card exists. Okay, yeah. <laughs> um, and I will end my turn. Or try to go to end phase. Uh, okay. Uh, two cards in grave. Yeah, end phase is fine. And then try to pass? Yeah, sure. Oh, let me banish these. Mm -hmm. Okay. Based on his profile, he's playing Shadulls. Uh, Tynos does play a lot of Shadulls, that's for sure. I do play a lot but of Shadulls. I can't, I can't be sure. He also plays a lot of Gamma in his deck. So I've never, I don't really know what's, what's going on here. I play a significant amount of Shadulls. Okay. So I guess we just force this out. Uh, we'll target this dude. Um, sure, yeah. Okay. And then Entis, pop the Zeus. Uh, okay, hold on a second here. Um, so we have some chain links here, right? So you're gonna be first, because they're all optional, I think? Yeah, they're all optional. Yeah, all They're optional. all optional, so you'll be chain link one. Okay, I'll go chain link two, Nerval, uh, chain link three Zeus to equip from somewhere, and then I gotta think about um, what I want to oh, wow. do. It's a cool card. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I will. Yeah. I'll I'll chain link again to send everything okay. else. And I think that's it. So this will go first. Then I'll equip something. Yeah. Uh, the question is what here? Something I want to equip. Deck. I guess I could equip that. Um. I'm already going to use Nerval this turn. I already have mm -hmm. this. Okay, I'll just equip this then. Let's just think for my okay. extra deck, actually. Actually, maybe I should just think for my extra deck. Ooh. I can equip for my extra deck too? Actually, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to equip from the extra deck. Yeah, I'm going to equip from the extra deck. Okay. Equip this. Okay. Yeah. Oh my god. Okay. Yeah. Um, and then you add. Then, then I add, right? Then I, I have two adds. No, I, this one. Okay, this Shurig is gonna be another chain link. So now I add, and then I'll add again. Okay. The Shurig, I'll have this add. This. 
And then, or sorry, this is not Shurik, because Shurik's in another chain link. Okay, I'm really trying to do this correct here. Yeah. Okay, so for, Nerval will add first. Yeah. Okay, so Nerval, I'll have it add this. Proctor. Then I'll get Proctor popped. Proctor sends from deck, right? Yeah, sends from deck. Discarding. Yeah. Okay. And then, uh, then NTSs will pop this. Yeah. And then on a new chain, I'll get the Shurag. Yes. Okay, I think we figured this out. Okay, we did it, boys. We did it. Add this. Is ja isn't Jack in the Hand banned from remote duels? No, they let this card go for some reason. Not sure why, but hey, they said okay. Okay. Uh, I'll special this, if that's okay. Yeah, that's good. Well then, use its effect. Oh, you do have gamma. Okay, cool. Hmm. Okay, then I think I'm just gonna do this. Oof, that was a crazy one. Hmm, but it's it, okay. There's at least some shadows in there for sure. We saw a schism, so there's a few. There's a <laughs> there few a... shadows. A couple, couple of shadows. A couple. Question is, what can I do against you? This card's pretty good, but only if I go first. It's funny. It's funny as hell, though, for sure. Those are my favorite cards. But it's on, that's only if I go first, unfortunately. Um, it's fine. Bing, bang, boom. What should I side out? Is this good against you or no? I'm trying to think. Seems okay, but it didn't seem that great. But it does seem okay. So I'll keep it in. Fuck it. Is this good against you? I have no clue. It's good if you draw in a dear servant. That's for sure. Hmm. Yeah. I totally run that card. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know if you do. I mean, like, I feel like you might as well online. So, All right. you might as well. I should get rid of these two. I have no clue what I'm doing, honestly, when it comes to siding with this deck. Maybe get rid of this. Maybe get rid of... Okay, I need to side out a few more cards here. I don't know, maybe I don't side this in. Two, three, four, one... Two, three, four. Do this. I play a budget trap version of Shadol. Dog Engine is way too expensive. Yeah, and the Deer Servant's like, how much is that card? Like ninety dollars or something? Yeah, it's a crazy amount. Oh, so many options. So many options. I love that He's I got options. a wealth of options. Okay. I like this one. Oh, okay. <laughs> He's made a decision. A <laughs> it's a... Uh, I don't know what to call this. Oh, that's a good draw. Uh, the Guru Player Special. Alright, well let's find out. Does he have it? Oh, he opened Lightning Stone. Okay. Uh, We'll change out again. Yeah, it's, I figure you had something like that. Yeah, you're good. You're good. Okay. It's so sinister. The games. Well. This kind of sucks. <laughs> Lightning Storm is good. It really is. <laughs> Uh, and this is flipped up. And then, 1D effect. Yeah, you're good. And beast effect yep. as chain link 2. Yep. Okay, so I draw. And I summon. Uh, 
Okay. What is this one? It, what is this? It specials from grave. Oh, it specials in face down defense, right? Yes. Okay, and if it's, it's sent, you. And then if it's yeah. flipped, special in face down. Oh, I see. If it's sent to the grave, you can special it. Right, right. I remember. Okay. Yeah. Got it. Got it. Got it. Okay. All right, so you've got two cards in the old hand. Oof, it's a good thing I had that lightning storm. We had some dirty, we had some dirty boys in the back row. We did. I really wish you did not. Mm hmm. Yeah. Let's reveal this one. This one. And this one. Okay. Again, uh, I'll, I'll do the same choice again. I'll just take okay. the choice. Oops, that's the wrong hand. Um, oh, it's because I put I can't put this card in the graveyard, or else I don't have the option. Um, what do I want? What do I want? I don't know. I guess Kinka is slightly better. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Grab the fractal. You want Tanyo's number after this game? I'm confused. Um, okay. What number? I don't know. I don't know. 42. What... There you go. That's the number. Oh, that's the number? Shoot. Okay. All right. Effect <laughs> of the fractal. Yeah. Okay. Back. Okay. Perfect. Yeah. We were going on the combo, everybody. Um, this one. An effect to search. Yeah. Grab this one. Effect of this one. Would you consider Royal Decree? It's actually not bad, although I side in like Dark some work against trap decks. Yeah. And then Hope. But Shadol trap decks are kind of hard because if they open Shadol fusion, you're like, well, that's rough, buddy. That is rough. All right, anything on this special summit of this guy? Nope. Interesting. Okay. I'll use the effect yeah. then. Okay. Um, let's go into this. And then chain link yeah. one Nerval or chain link one fridge, chain link two Nerval. Uh, yeah. Let's grab another fractal here. We negate that, negate that, and then make... Wait, what do I have in my deck? Oh, I do have this. Interesting. Okay. Um, in that case... Let's just do that, that, that.
Okay. Okay. And then I'll use the effect of this guy. Three. Summon here. Enter battle. Mm hmm. Um. Attack like that. Uh, I'll use its effect. Okay, I'll use the app. Yeah. Back here. And then end phase, I'll use the yeah. bird, set it up that, let's summon this. Oh no, infinite negates. <laughs> no, just one. You, you need the union carrier to do all of them. <sighs> this negates anything. Um, okay, let's use the some more then. Yeah. Summon out. And then effect of cobalt. Mm hmm Let's just add. All right, so let's go. Oh wait, I don't have an actual link monster that uses these two. Never mind. Good. Maybe I shouldn't have summoned because I'm out of space. Ah. Uh... Exactly what I wanted. Oops. There's really nothing I can summon. Two wind monsters. Everything's beast, <laughs> beast warrior. Nightmare Phoenix? I don't even I, maybe I should run a Nightmare Phoenix, honest to God, but. Alright. Let's just go attacking then, I guess. Uh, uh let me think. This thing summons from the Samoric Link. Does it summon from hand? Yeah, or... I can summon from the hand as well. It can? Oh, yeah. that's insane. I can resummon the Avion. Well. Uh, Chain Dynamisk is targeting. That. This one can't be targeted. Oh, okay. Not this. <laughs> I mean, I guess I'll just use this. Target okay. itself. Yeah, I mean. And then I, I guess I was attacking with this one, I think. Yeah. Okay. I'll use the effect. I mean, yeah. we'll try to use this effect. Sure. And the attack for these, I guess. And you can sum it back. Guess who's back? 
Yeah. Okay. Um, okay, let me think. Couple options. Okay. The Cleegy effect. Oh, yeah, that's good. Effect. I have to let this one resolve if I don't want you to use your extra deck, right? Yep. Okay. That's fine. It's fine? Yep. Okay. I like the extra deck locking aspect of this. Mm-hmm. And now we'll tackle this. Yeah. Let's summon out... Guy. Okay. I ordered King of Bayou. They're only like a few dollars. Don't worry. <laughs> okay, I will. How many do I have in here? Um, I will activate Link Karibo. Tributing this. Okay. Thing. Yeah. And then, yeah, it's one. I just don't want to go over five this turn. Banish three. Yeah. Summon out. I don't know. I guess this guy. Oops. Oh, it won't let me special him. Ugh, okay, it's the stupid bug. It doesn't know. Okay. Okay. Uh, let's shuffle back. I don't fucking know. Let's shuffle back a Wendy with this guy. Okay. All right. Let's link the two. This. Uh, I mean, doesn't really matter. No, it doesn't really matter. Do I get this one. I sure. guess I'll negate. I guess. Let's banish this. Oh, I should have banished the other one. It doesn't really matter yes. though. <laughs> it's fine. I haven't normal summoned yet, so it's not the big deal. I'm pretty sure if I check the log, you normal summoned. Uh... What's in his face? No, I, I had to return it. To, I had to return it to my hand. I was uh, just joking. Uh, I was joking. Uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, that's game. Attack. GG. 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 That lightning storm was was a nice lightning storm. Lucky lightning storm for sure. Yeah. Okay. Change this. All right, I'll be right back. I got to the bathroom. Oh.
You should audition for the tournament that Farfa and MBT are hosting. Uh, you definitely should. I thought, where is the link? I thought I applied already to that. They might have another link though. Uh, Farfa uploaded a video. Oh, really? Okay, I'm gonna go look at it. I already applied to one Google Doc. Let's see, Farfa. Go look. Is it in one of his videos? It's the what a year video. What a year? Okay. Yeah, it's the first link in the description. Oh, I see, I see. So, it's your boy Farfa from Team Samurai X1. Happy Tuesday! 2020 is now. We're watching this. Upload schedule is only. <laughs> Two weeks late. Two weeks later. <laughs> Thank you, SpongeBob. My face when opponent opponent to draw good card. <laughs> <laughs> dude, that that Simo laugh is so funny, dude. Real direction or meaning in the first place. Let's address the big elephant in the room. I know what you're thinking. Yes, I did indeed get a new girlfriend. Welcome to my channel, everybody. Please subscribe. Now, unfortunately, there wasn't a tour guide version available, so if anyone does have one, please let me know. It's not cheating if it's an open relationship. 2020 <laughs> was a year filled with... Pen best deck! Don't you know, pump it up! What the fuck? Pen best deck, baby, let's go! <laughs> True. Let's go! <laughs> Dude, his, his apartment looks very interesting. Ryan, 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 Ryan. I always told myself I'd make it to the YCS top main stage one day, and I guess I wasn't lying. And also, what's clear is that I have indeed managed to fail in the goal of trying to hit 100k subscribers. Oh, am I subscribed That's to Farfa? Okay. I mean, you can't I'm not. To hit such okay. There we go. Fixed it. Videos in like three Fixed months. it. If you had told me something like, Hi's barriers are getting support next year, I would have taken it as a throwaway joke. But there are also some positives to take away from this. Myself and Joseph Rothschild here, aka MBT, will be taking part in an online PT tournament at the end of the month, courtesy of Luxury Card Gaming. And of course, for the average Farfa viewer who does have a degree in astrophysics and mathematics, you might have been observant and recognized. Hey, Ishan, do you like fish sticks? I'm sorry, I missed that. Doesn't really constitute not really three entry. Hmm. I like fish and chips though. That's right. But like the you frozen ones, I don't really like. The third member. Yes, you. Me? You can apply in the link in the description down below where me and MBT at some point next week, more details to come, will be reviewing and reading the applications live on our streams soon. We are essentially providing a charitable service by using our skill and prowess as master duelists to take one random member from the community based off of the application process and carrying you all the way to the first ever <laughs> major event. Okay, whoa. Could go wrong. Now, most important. They're going to carry me, bro. All right, I like it. I like it. Well, clearly, it seems that the first step to achieving any major goal is uploading videos. At least that's what I've noticed over the last few months. Hmm. Just upload the video. <laughs> like, take the content and put it on the internet. Okay, and yes, Diablo, uploading and is important. Yeah, bye. Okay, let's apply then. Are you guys, are you guys gonna help me write my application? Yes. Provide an image if possible. What makes you a good candidate for our 3v13? What should I write this? Don't they both hate Grand Maju? Well, since both you both both of you dislike grandma Ju. i already helped you write your twitter oh uh, yes yes you did since both of you dislike grandma Ju, <laughs> it would only make sense that i would be third member to bring pal that way balance world peace and order would be restored in the world
Also, you guys farmed my second place YCS Portland Gwen Lodge deck for content. The least <laughs> you could do <laughs> is throw. <laughs> Just give me something back. <laughs> Hey Donovan. Hey you, Sean. How's it going over here? Who got it? Uh, I got it. You got it, huh? Yep. I'm trying All to right. write. I'm trying to write an application. Throw me a bone. I like that. That's more. That's more. Uh, it's. I like. I like how it sounds better. On Wendy's. Did an application. Did Farfa say anything about Grand Maju? Farfa. I don't know if he actually used Weiss's Portland content. Donovan. What's up, Leon? Do you have Wendy? No, he doesn't really have anything from here. I don't have Wendy. Why is that Rob? He did talk about your deck list on stream for like two minutes when you did win. Okay, okay. Oh, you were watching? Okay, perfect, perfect. Okay, so I, it's not a lie <laughs> to say that he fought. <laughs> also, you guys farm my second place wise is Portland Grand Logic deck for content. At least you could do is throw me a boat. Provide an image if possible. Fair. All right. I need to take a picture of myself. Yisha, what are you submitting an application for? A far and MBT are looking for a third member for the 3v3. A third member for the 3v3. Ooh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> You actually know what might really help your your odds, Ishan, is you slip them a little bit of um, um, Amazon gift cards <laughs> along the way. I, I I guess they expect an image or a link. Yeah, they don't have a way to upload it. Okay, I need I need okay. This answer we can work on. Maybe we can add more. Uh, we don't want to be too long, but we don't want to be too short either. What should we say for the first Just one? Link them to some Amazon gift cards. <laughs> no, I. Can't. That's the shortest link. It's one. It's one line. <laughs> Two lines, depending how long the string is. But, but you know, maybe I should send a video. I can like record a, a quick video. And um. Or you can just cram money down their throats. That's. I'm willing to bribe. I mean, what are they going to do? Say no? I am also willing to pay bribes. No, that seems desperate, though, right? This seems desperate. I feel like that's too desperate. I feel like that's too desperate. Okay, just say you're down DTF, then. You're, I'm down fuck. <laughs> Alright, let's see, let's see, let's see. I never know you channels like that. He was down to fuck. <laughs> All right, round three pairings are up. It's like a whole new world. Round three pairings are up. Okay, we'll work on we'll work on this form later. I'm also willing to carry the team. Who am I playing against? Why is it so small? Okay, let's see. Like, I, I, it needs to be a balance of not too much of bashing them, but just enough, right? You, you need to bash them just enough so it's funny. But not too much, so that it makes it seem like you actually hate their guts. You know, it's like uh, I don't know. Do they? Does he hate me? <laughs> Is he being serious? Uh, okay, round three pairings are up. Oh, I'm against Andrew. Shit. Okay. So we can wait for Andrew to show up in here. Um. I'll make both of you look better by comparison. Ooh, that's interesting. That's an interesting one. But then that, that, that down talks me. Then I'm like, oh, then maybe they're like, oh, this guy sucks. I don't want him anymore. I'll probably record a video and link it here of my setup. Um,
Our combined wit and charm will take us to the top. <laughs> oh. Hey, Andrew. I can't hear you, though, Andrew. For some reason. Rip? Wait, maybe it's my fault. Hold on a second. I can't hear Andrew either. You can't hear Andrew either? Okay, now I can hear you, Tiger. Okay, so I guess... <clears throat> Never mind. Raise the looks average. Raise the. Oh, whoops! My camera died. Whoops. Oh, someone's calling. Oh, Andrew is calling me. Oh, on Messenger. Okay, I'm gonna go pick up on Messenger then. Oh, I see. I see. I see. I see. Okay, he wants to call back on Messenger. Okay, that fixed it. That fixed it. Hello? Or, hey, I, mean, I guess me. Andrew. Probably, I guess we could probably just call you on Discord then, huh? Yeah, you can call me on Discord too. I don't know what's going on here. It's weird. It's, it's, cable one's kind of weird. I'll just call you on Discord. Okay, sounds good. He still looks average. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like Farf and MBT are decently looking dudes. I mean, we're fucking Yu Gi Oh players. We're not fucking, you know, hottie make hot face. You know? Audie McHot face. Ah, uh, ah, uh, I, appre I appreciate it, Oria. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Whoops, for some reason, I'm not getting a call from Andrew. Oh, I am. It's just not giving me a notification. Okay, hey. hey. Okay, that's kind of weird. I don't know what, what the deal is there. Yeah, that is weird. I don't really know. Because Donovan said he was having the same issue, but um, did you set up? Are you in a room right now? I'll, I'll make one. I'll make one. Okay, thanks. Yeah, I was like, oh no, time's ticking. <laughs> oh, but it's, or if you're playing prank, it, that's a good thing, right? Okay, I made one. I'm. You might have. Well, I don't want to seem like a. No, it's like okay. A I don't care. I don't care about these matches. I'm just practicing. Oh yeah, I got bigger fish to fry. <laughs> I mean, I care. I care. I'd rather <laughs> win than lose, but who wouldn't, right? So, oh yeah, given the choice, huh? Interesting one. Tell oh Jorge says hi, and he says that you're handsome. Oh, <laughs> I would call him the same, but he's not here. <laughs> what separates me from? Okay, um, let's start with the tanky. Okay. Tanky. <laughs> I saw, okay, I know that. I saw you playing this on stream last time. Oh, okay, okay. So you know you. That's good. That's good. You know a little bit about what's going on here. Yeah. Hmm. What should I do here? What should I do? Fractal. These tribe. I haven't played in a long time, so then everybody's talking about these tribe brigade cards, and I was like, they're pretty good. They are pretty good, actually. Yeah. Let's do. Yeah. Oh boy. Yeah, no. Yeah. Okay, so then let's get this guy. So chain link one. Cobalt sparrow chain two nerval. Okay. Okay, so let's see here. Um, what do I want to search? The options are limitless. Yeah, they do feel that way sometimes. <laughs> yes, we can search a level one wing beast. I guess we can search this special special. Kind of cool, you could search like DD Crow or something off of that. Yeah, you can search DD Crow, which is kind of nice. Uh, doesn't feel that good though. Okay, I'll just add this, I guess. 
case control wing base first of all, this guy. Okay. Alright, I will activate it. Mm -hmm. Go like oh, this. The old different dimension crow. Hmm. So effect, effect, blah 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 blah. Which effects? I'm just I'm just thinking. Uh, okay. Sorry. So that to that. We know what I'm supposed to do here. Okay, let's go to this. This one searches, right? Yeah, this one searches. Okay. I will activate the effect. Search. Mm. Mm, what should I search here? I don't know. Let's search this, I guess. Another nerve ball. Mm -hmm. Seems good. I'd like to make Appaloosa, but... Oh, man. Appaloosa. Got some crazy stuff going on here. Because <laughs> I haven't <laughs> normal yet, so let's normal this. And then effect. Finish two. So he banishes two and then he like you summon a Yeah, I summon a tri beast type from my extra. Okay. Alright, so let's summon this. Okay, anything on this guy's summon? Uh just reading it. During your faint phase you can Okay. Okay, so in that case I will Activate the effect to summon. Summons from hand, right? Yeah, summons from hand. Okay. Fractal. Let's link all these off. Or a Lusa. For trace. And then I'll use the refrigerator to draw a card and put one back on the bottom. Okay. The link monitor. Bottom this. Hmm, this hand's not the greatest, but oh well. Uh, okay, I will use Fractal then. So Banish. Fractal. Uh, the same. They all have the same second effect, or the first effect, or whatever, where you banish to summon. Okay, okay. I wasn't sure if there was like some other effects I didn't know about. But yeah, a fra fractal has the effect I can discard to discard them, or or send them from hand or field to graveyard to dump a tri brigade. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I see. Second and then they all have the same the second effect where you banish and um and then special. All right, so end phase, I will activate this. So the special summon one. Okay. Let's summon out guy. All right. Crazy days. Crazy days. Okay, so what are we working with here? We got three monster negates. And then the, the more guy, does he negate? The more doesn't negate, but then you have the statue. That's it, basically. The, the three statue, monster negates right. and the statue. Mm -hmm. And then you got the Link Karibo. And the Link Karibo. Blocking it. Right. Oh, boy. Okay, yeah, that's fine. It's Mystic Mind time. Uh, Is it Mystic Mind? It's time to mine. <laughs> 
fine, boys. Hopefully it buys us some time. Um, end phase? Yeah, that's good. Shit. This deck always likes to play Mystic. <laughs> Guess maybe I should be a little more careful. Maybe I should link off some stuff. Not sure though. Hmm. Oh, I kind of I made a mistake there. Hmm. Whatever. Yeah. Okay. Let me see what I should do. Okay. Main phase. So, make sure I'm not going to screw this up. So, it's as long as you control more than me. Okay. Oh. Should I even do that? Nah, fuck it. Or just do this. Okay. Let's send, um... I don't know. Uh... Okay, in phase. Not normal. Mm -hmm. Oh, sorry. End of main phase. Yeah, you're good. Okay, doing the battle. Okay, main two. Rock effect. Mm -hmm. uh, which one do I not want? Chain link two dodo, chain link one drop. Mm -hmm. I'm supposed to gain the power before, but. Oh, judge. Wow. I, I want to judge. <laughs> <laughs> we are crazy people like that. Do I even do this? Is that even right? I don't know if that's correct. Seems like it's not correct to do that. But then that seems because you could just do that. Okay, I'll activate mm -hmm. and then I'll do Graveyard, graveyard. Mm -hmm. okay. And then we'll do chain link two fanzies. Oh, just just fanzies. Yeah. Okay. Kids plan. And then we'll run them out. Okay. 
and we will link these guys off. Then there's like a part of me, it's just like, should I even be doing any of this just so I should be the mystic mind? I don't know. It's hard to say. It really is. Man. Okay. I think from here, just gonna pass to you. I dare you to put Mystic Mind did nothing wrong. <laughs> nothing wrong at all. Yeah, Mystic Mind is good against this deck. Yeah, they're a match made in heaven. Uh, I'm thinking, what if I want to activate these effects? Let's turn the tribute disc. So in end phase, I'll activate the bark. Uh -huh. I will add. Who do I want to add here? We'll add the green and the fusion to our end. Then we'll activate this and we will summon out. We'll all target the link guys. Okay. And uh, anything else in end phase? Are you good? No, I'm good. Okay, cool. Main phase? Mm hmm. Okay. Twenty-seven, right for Appalosa. Twenty-four. Twenty-four, right? Okay, eight hundred. Still going battle phase. Mm-hmm. Attack Appalosa. It was 3,000? Yeah. 600? Yeah. And then... How is, is this going to happen or is this not going to happen? Mm -hmm. I think that should probably happen. Nah, it doesn't matter. Okay, main phase two. A normal this guy. Mm -hmm. and, oops, that was a misclick. If we have the same, I can activate, right? If I, I haven't read this card in so long. Yeah, if you have the same, you can activate. Right, right, okay. There's nothing I even want. <laughs> Just a bunch of bullshit prank is. Yeah, okay. I'm gonna. Do this. And then I'll activate Fancy's effect to. Yeah, I'll activate Fancy's effect. Yep. Too late for that, though, fortunately. Well, give it a shot. <laughs> oh, okay. We will. How do we want to do this? I guess this is main phase, yeah. 
helpful. Good, Damn. good thing. <laughs> yeah, good thing the app Lusa is gone. Oh, that would be nice. That would be nice, yeah. Well, for, not for me, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> not for you, yes. No. I'll summon this fucker. And then, um, oh, those will be a different chain link. Okay. So then, chain link, two drop and one lamp. Yep. I'm not gonna summon, I'm just using their first effect. Okay, so I take 500. Yeah, yeah. Tell me there's a chance. There is a chance. Target yeah. two prank kids, non fusion monsters with different names in your game, right? Special summon them. They cannot be destroyed by battle. No, no, no. <laughs> it cannot. How do we make this card the most annoying we can? Yeah. Okay, interesting. Um. No battle butler yet. I want to do. Okay, let's. <laughs> Alright, let's normal summon this target. <laughs> Target, uh, let's target the Cobalt Sparrow. Cobalt Sparrow. Mm -hmm. I'll, uh, I'll crow that, the Sparrow. Alright, um, okay, I will activate Fractal back. So what does it do? It, it sends a oh, tribe grade oh. from deck to grave. Okay. okay. So I will send Nerval, and then I'll activate Nerval's effect. Oh, Ash Nerval. It's the wrong zone. Normal summon. Normal summon. Alright, you're good. Okay, I will activate the effect banishing or Spooky. Okay. Spooky. Go with this guy. Oh, this guy looks spooky. He's quite so good. And then banish one card in the field. Oh, and of course it doesn't target. <laughs> yes, it does not target. Key. Mm. That is the key. Key factor. Okay, I'll activate it. And what is what is it you're activating now? Your the sh the the one to banish. The... Oh, banish is when he's summoned too. It's not just when. Yeah, it's when, it's when he's summoned. Card. Yeah, it's when he's summoned. I'll, um. All right, I'm gonna change some effects here. Okay. I'm going to activate Washer as Chain Link 2. Okay. And then, it, what does the tanky do? It buffs all the beast warriors. Yeah, I don't think I care about that. Okay, and then I'll, sum, I'll target the uh, Bark and the Dodo. Uh, the Bark and the Dodo... Oh yeah, the two links. Okay, yeah, that's yeah. good. Good. Okay, and um, can I still act? I can't activate the bark on the chain. Yeah, chain not yet. Yeah, because yeah, this one will resolve. Okay. Yeah. First, the question is, who should I send to Jesus? Is it the Bow Wow Bark or is it the Rip Roaring Roaster? Who is it gonna be? Can't destroy these by battle. So annoying. <laughs> that is so annoying. Okay. Um, is this thing the uh, omen guy? What's up? Oh yeah, the banishes once per turn. Okay. I imagine just like every time you summon yeah. a beat. That would be that would be something. Yeah. Okay, I guess I will. Okay, you saw that stupid trap in the grave too. I don't really want to attack either. <laughs> Yeah, I'll 
banish this, I guess. Okay. Yeah, I think that's probably what you should banish. It's probably the best thing. Yeah, because it adds more, more adding, more. Yeah, it's on my on your turn. Yeah, then. on my turn. Yeah, exactly. Okay. You have like more than enough prank it so that I'll never ever be able to <laughs> do anything about that. We'll continue. Hopefully. Unfortunately, this doesn't. <laughs> I mean, I guess. Seems decent, actually. All right, let's. So I used. Oh, I used Fractal Norval's first effects and Karis's second. Okay. Okay. Let's link these two off. Actually. This let's link these two off. These two off. Okay, okay. Let's grab the refrigerator. Hold, how did the where oh at your Adding him off of the Keras or no, I, I linked off Kinka and the link four for the link two. And, and then, then uh, and then I'm and then I'm gonna use the link four to add something. So when he's sent to the graveyard, he um yeah, adds he, from your deck or yeah, he adds from deck, yeah. Okay, cool. So I will add I even have another nerve ball in my deck? Not. Okay. The nerve ball's like the man. Yeah, he's the he man. Because he adds, he adds... Yeah, he's just a for the whole thing. Okay, so okay. I will use the effect of refrigerator to special from my hand. Okay. So I will special summon out this one. Mm-hmm. Then I'll use this guy. What is this? Same thing, right? Yeah, You're banish two. Yeah. Um, and I will summon out. This. This card in your possession is sent to graveyard by an opponent's card. Okay. Um. And then I will use his effect, sending this to the graveyard. Yeah, bounce that. Um, and then phase effect of some morgue. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, I think I could have played this one a little bit better. Oh, I got. I was like, I, I need. Yeah, I think you probably want to try to OTK when you get rid of the Mystic Mine. Yeah, or I, I, I guess uh, OX. Well, I actually, I finally, drew, I drew my out, I guess, so. Maybe not, I, I don't I, know. Yeah, I think I could have killed more dudes there. Um, like, well, killed at I could have killed at least the other Tri-Brigade monster there, and then... Um, or, or maybe out. you should... I think, yeah, maybe you should have killed Applister right away, and then went, like, prank its place, and then try to OTK, maybe. That's, yeah, yeah, I think that would have been good. Yeah. Kill Appaloosa and then just go prank its place. Jorge says put Droll in. Are you sure, Jorge? Is that good? I feel like that's not that good. Maybe that we get some... Uh, yeah, I've never really... I don't really think Droll's that good against prank kids. Yeah, Droll's like a... I mean, it, 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 could, it could be good against the right hand, I guess. 
Yeah, yeah. yeah, that's true. I guess against like a desire's hand. Um. Well then. But then there's like the um the green guy. If you need the fusion, you can just send them to the grave, and then the you can add it. Right. Exactly. Go. So it's like it's not that good. I feel like. I feel like I just put this card in. This card's not even. That good, to be honest. I don't even know if I want any of these cards. Side deck is not looking the greatest. I think these. I'm going probably going second though. Or hey, I'm not sure. Actually, I should put this. Oh, I should put that card in. Fuck. Oh well. Okay. Oh shit. No, it's fine. I, I should. It's fine. It's not that big a deal. It's not that big of a deal. All right. Main phase. Thinking. How am I gonna do this one here? All desires. Yeah, that's good. That's good. All right, banish three of one of them, then we should be good. Quite a lot of children were banished here. <laughs> oh, oh no! <laughs> Not the children. Yeah, that's good. Play good. Yeah, that's good. Good in the hood. How to play this a little bit differently because of the way that worked out. Okay, normal. Mm -hmm. Drop. Mm -hmm. Drop it, drop it, drop it like Exactly. Oh my. I didn't even realize it was that bad. There oh. was. You know what? I'm just gonna. The, the, it literally banished multiples of like the green, like of several of them. There's no way. <laughs> Maybe, yeah. Are you sure Desires is okay in this deck? I feel like maybe it's a little risky in this deck. It, you know, it doesn't... It Sometimes it will fuck you over, but most of the time it doesn't. Interesting. But Interesting. normally you're supposed to do it after your combo, but... Oh, to I look had for a, hand I drafts. Just had a in my hand. Oh, you know, really? It's like, oh, that's rough. Yeah, because like you, get, you get them all in the graveyard, and then you... Um, then you Desires, and then you, shuffle them all back later. Yeah. I see, I see. Yeah. That was uh that was not pretty. <laughs> yeah, I, I guess that that make that's okay then. Yeah, that makes sense actually. Because if you don't have a prank it's anyway, then your hand is bad. So. Yeah, the first game I was uh, I definitely misplayed that one just with the I mean the Mystic Mine because I was kind of like not sure if I should just try to deck you out and I was like no you're probably gonna have an out for that so I need to set something up so I just you don't just like feather duster me and then OTK me. Yeah. Then it, yeah. I'm not um well versed in the art of the mine. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Bailey's very good at using Mystic Mine. That dude, oh, yeah, that dude always that. has it at the right. I'm like, fuck. Shit, I can't <laughs> play around mine. Oh well. It's like, oh. Yeah, I'm not sure what you're supposed to set up there. Because I mean, I feel because you're supposed to like build up resources so that you can just do have stuff to do like, in your opponent's turn, but like you don't have monsters on the board. So I think you probably wait so that you can get like um, what's it called? Like the fusion on the field, and then all three on in hand. So then maybe you can just like on your opponent's turn, like if they feather duster you, you chain right. the fusion, you get card lucky, and then you just nuke their board that way. Right, that way, or you go for like an access code OTK. Like yeah, that actually seems pretty good. Too. That seems pretty good. Yeah, with one or that one right. or the other. Yeah. All right. Well, GG's, man. GG. I uh, gotta bounce later. Okay. See ya. All right, boys. I'm gonna be right back. Go to the bathroom. I'll put on a doing book. Let's spectate something. I'll be right back. Three and L. That's not bad.
Okay, I'm back, boys. Oh, you guys want to see what I got the other day? That might be the last game. I'll, I'll leave this on, but I'll show you guys what I got in the mail today. Something every Yu-Gi-Oh player loves. Look at this shit, bro. Look at this. I got a whole fucking case of Dragon Shield clears standardized to the double sleeving. Look at this, bro. It's crazy. How do you guys double sleeve? That's what I want to know. Do you guys, what do you guys use to double sleeve? That's crazy, bro. My scissors at scissors. <laughs> All right. Also, we have to finish our application, guys. We got to go back to finishing our application. What should I say here? Uh, yes, I have a nice. Got these dragon shields. Sponsoring dragon shield will share dragon shields. <laughs> Dude, I love dragon shields. Love them. Okay. All right, guys. I think. Uh, yes. I have a blue Yeti and a mic stand. So you know I am a professional content creator. By the time you read this, I will have almost made $10 from YouTube. <laughs> I'm an eat athlete. Professional Yu-Gi-Oh content creator. I guess it's Blue Yeti. I, oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna sleeve up this deck too. Okay, so the thing is like, I don't know if you guys see this. We have the Ash in a in a normal size sleeve. I think now I want because I like to have the. I don't know if you guys are the same. Do you guys like to have like so the at this. This is the top of the card, right? And then the opening is also at the top. Do you guys like that as well? Do you guys like, like that? Do you, is that how you guys like? I like the opening to be at the top of the card. I like the opening of the sleeve to be at the top of the card. But I think if you're going to double sleeve, I think you're supposed to, to take the card out. And in the inner sleeve, you flip it upside down so that that way in the outer sleeve, you can have it right side up. Is that, is that correct? I think that's correct. So you have it like this. So that way the ash faces up. Like this. And the top is here. I think that's what you want. Right? That seems right to me. Because you're supposed to have like, you, you, you're supposed to have like, um, all, it's supposed to be like sealed, I guess. That looks pretty cool. You also know what I love about double sleeving? I finally get to double sleeve these, these sleeves, bro. Like if you have nice sleeves like this, then you can double sleeve them. Okay, so while I work on that, what do you guys think about, um, Let's keep writing this, I guess. Uh, I was almost saying, this is supposed to be a slight slumlight joke. I'm not getting rich off YouTube, guys. Don't worry. Or streaming for that matter, but it's fun. It's something to do. I enjoy it, so. Okay. 
Okay, we also have to answer their dueling book question. So what's our answer to the dueling book question? Of course we know how to play use dueling book. Right? The question is... Is there any way we can wittily answer that? I don't think so. Like, why would they even ask that? Who doesn't know how to use Dueling Book? Like, that's crazy. I mean, it's not that hard to figure out either, but... Whoa, these cards are so thick now. They're so thick. They're so thick. Crazy. Crazy, guys. It's crazy. My deck has never been this thick before. I frequently, <laughs> no, I know right where the judge button is. I frequently play on Dueling Book. Uh, in fact, <laughs> in fact, I can call, I like this Patrick, I can call a judge with my eyes closed. <laughs> That's good, actually. I like that. I can call a judge with my eyes closed. <laughs> That's good. That is good. Oh, I have to go back to here. Uh, I got it. Okay, I mean, that's pretty good, right? <laughs> In fact, I know right where the judge button is. <laughs> I can write an appeal without watching, too. <laughs> hmm. I can, is that good to add or no? I don't know. When are they going to stream reading this? I want to watch. I want to watch them read mine. That looks, that would be kind of fun. All right, I'll, I'll record a little video of my setup. Seems a little bit verbose, but yeah, like, I, I guess I'm trying to see, like, is that like a good, like, um, Is that like a good... I'm gonna charge this phone so that I can record a oh, setup. I think I'm gonna leave it out. The reason is because like, I feel like the judges on Dueling Book are pretty good. They're not bad. Like, yes, they get some calls wrong, but like, I mean, all judges are gonna get some calls wrong. Like, it's just a fact of life. So, I couldn't do a better job than they do, so, to be honest. I'm gonna leave that here. <laughs> I guess Portland is capitalized. Damn, double sleeping. Do you guys like double sleeping? 
I, I don't know. The bigger card size feels a little weird to me right now still. Like, I'm still not used to the bigger card size. But I don't know. It's hard to say. I haven't really looked into it too deeply, to be honest with you guys. Like, it's, it's weird, because, like, these are, like, magic card size, and I've played magic before, but for some reason, holding Yu-Gi-Oh cards when they're this big just feels off. With third member. What do you mean by with third member, Patrick? Oops. First sentence for a 3v3 question. Do you have a mic setup suitable for a 3v3 tournament? I guess, I mean, I do, I guess. The answer to that is yes, I just don't see how. I guess I'm a little confused, that's all. First sentence for 3v3 question. I guess I'm just not, I'm just confused about what you're trying to tell me, that's all. I don't really understand what you're trying to tell me. I mean, I could, I guess I could, a, I don't know. I don't know. I think this is pretty good. I guess I want to make it clear that I'm joking, but n not like, I don't want to take away from the, the, the literature, right? Like, I want to make it clear that I'm joking, but I don't want to... Oh, 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 with third member doesn't sound grammatically good. Uh... Yes, I have a blue eddy and a mic stand, and I know I'm professional. Oh, oh, I didn't read this before. I would be the third member, not with. Why am I using this, too? It should be the third. Number. I feel like this double world. Let's go peace balance and order. That sounds better for some reason. I don't know why. That sounds better though, right? <laughs> Okay, how many packs did I win? That that was apparently it. That was a three-round tournament. How many did I get? And what packs are they? Hopefully there's something good. 
Genesis Impactors. Is that good? Is Genesis Impactor a good set? I won four packs. Four is not horrible, I guess. Not like counting in. Okay. That's something. All right, then. We're chilling. All right, so I'll just like upload a short YouTube video with you guys in, on the stream with a stream and then we'll send it in and call it a day. I feel like some people are just going to write like freaking essays out the wazoo. Crazy, bro. Crazy. I'm going to write essays out the wazoo. How am I going to beat like a whole essay, guys? Like, someone might write, like, a fucking five-page essay. Will they even want to read that, though? Shit, I don't know. You think Firefly wants to read an entire essay? Depends. If it's well-written, I think he'll keep reading it. If the content is good, he won't stop reading it. If it, like, sucks, like, it's, like, the same thing over and over again, and it's not a good essay then he won't read it. But if it's good, it's like, I mean, any streamer is like this. If the content's good, you're, you'll see them. They'll read it. Don't worry. They'll read it. They'll read it. Is it Locals tomorrow? Yeah, I could play in the Locals tomorrow. I sort of wanted to go home this weekend. But... Doing remote duel. Interesting. I'm imagining Samurai. There's no way Samurai is going to enter this. They're looking for someone that can, like, help them with, like, add a, add a, add a new dynamic, right? Which, like, I think I can do. The question is, is this, am I the kind of dynamic they want? Right? Like, I think it's cool. And I think it's a great opportunity for like a small content creator or just anyone that wants to to meet them. Um, but I don't know. Like, what do you think they want in a third wheel? They don't want someone like them. Or maybe they do. They maybe they want like I don't know. I have no clue. I have no idea what they want. I mean, let's be honest. I probably won't. I probably won't. Uh, I probably won't get a third wheel. But that's probably okay. I was probably planning on playing with some of my friends anyway. But I don't know what they want, really. But I'm sure they'll find it. They'll probably just pick the the, the funniest one and call it a day. It's hard to be the funniest though. Out of like, I mean, how many people do you think I would apply? Like 500, maybe more. I don't know. What do you guys think? How many people do you think will apply? I have no clue. I have no idea if this is this is all the is this all there is to the form or is there more? I can always hit cancel. Oh yeah, this is not even oh this is not even the whole form. Wait, we we have so much more to to put in, guys. What are your shortcomings and weaknesses as a duelist? <laughs> the chiller okay well these guys got some interesting questions 
Let's answer these questions, guys. These, got, these are some interesting questions. I like their questions here. Okay, what deck would you play for this event? Please provide a sample deck list with explanations. Shit, bro. <laughs> I would have to play Grand Maju. Maju, as it is my signature deck. I'll have to make it, I'll have to get like a text version of the deck list, huh? And, uh, and, and do the explanations. What is my most? I got second at YCS Portland with Golden Castle Grand Maju. Earning Grand Maju's first ever YCS top and bringing the deck into the mainstream. What are my sh okay? Well, you guys, you guys are watching. You guys are my viewers. What are my sh shortcomings as a duelist? <laughs> Tell me, guys. Tell me, guys. What are my shortcomings as a duelist? Where can I improve on my game the most? Being too strong at the game. No, I think I definitely have some weaknesses. I think I like. I think I tunnel vision sometimes. I tunnel vision sometimes, and I and I sometimes forget to respond to card effects when I'm playing in real life. Eight to the tournament because you apply a deodorant. Like, I feel like a lot of my misplays are like, oh, I should have done this, and like, I didn't respond. I don't know, it's hard to say. Like, I didn't respond, like, like at the, at the extravaganza, I made a few misplays, I, like, I just like, held cards for no reason when I should have used them. I feel like those are my biggest, one of my bigger shortcomings if I'm being like honest with myself. You know. Uh what do you guys think? I think that sometimes Other things that are 
happening in the game that caused me to lose. <laughs> Trouble side decking? <laughs> I don't know if it's I feel like I'm just like, I'm, I'm, I'm actually just putting more thought into it than most duelists are, I feel like. To be honest, side decking, there, there comes a point in side decking where it's just formulaic once you figure it out, right? It's like in this matchup, I side this, this, and this, and I put in this, this, and this. You know, like if it's a standard, like, oh, I'm against Drytron. I know exactly what I'm planning on doing going first. I know exactly what I'm planning on doing and going second. You know, that sort of thing. Analysis process. I, I do agree. Sometimes I do overthink. Sometimes I don't think enough. It's. These are all pretty, like, standard, you know. I don't know. I think that's the same thing as tunnel vision, analysis, paralysis. Okay, what do you guys think the answer is? I'm curious, I'll ask you guys what you guys think. I, I know what I think the answer is. I'm gonna do the math to double check. What do you guys think the answer is? You guys think you should upstart first or duality first? The instinct is to upstart first, but I wonder, I wonder if, actually a trick question, you know, in general, you should upstart first before you duality, that way you have a better, you, you have like, you know what the upstart's going to be before you select a card, right? That way you have more information when you do select a card. In general, all other things being equal, it's better that way. Um, but does it actually make a difference when it comes to finding one specific card? Yeah, like, I mean, this could be a trick question. Let's do the math real quick. Oh, hey, quick little math and Yu-Gi-Oh video. Although I don't really want to upload this until they read. Until they read, um until they read all the applications. Right, but I, let's just assume their question is pretty straightforward here and that um, they want to do this. Okay, let's, let's do a little thing here. Let's go to the hypergeometric calculator. Okay, so there's two options. The first one is we upstart first and then duality. In that case, let's just say we have 35 cards in our deck. Or let's say we have 10 cards in our deck. This will make it simpler, right? I think slightly yes, because we're looking at the top four. The sample size is, or the number of successes is one. Basically, we're looking at the top four cards of our deck, right? For upstart first and duality. Uh, and then this is one. This is 40%, right? Doesn't matter as many the cards. I think the other way is worse, because the other way is... Um, the other way is you get three choices, right? So you have a 30% off the duality. Um, and then 70% of the time, um, because the cards get shuffled back, 70% of the time you're not going to draw the Raigeki. So then you get uh, 1 in 10 uh, every 70% 70, 70 of the time to draw Raigeki. So you get 3.7 uh, 3 versus 4. So you lose some, some value, so you should upstart first. Right? Yeah. That seems right. Of 
break though. Sometimes these dragon shields come catch. Okay. Once in a while you get a weird pack of dragon shields. Genie Vong, I usually make Apple loose since everyone Nibiru's me, then I make some more. Yeah, yeah, I mean I go with that play too, Genie. I try to do that because it's good against the hand traps and it baits out the Nibiru. Okay, so we got the calculations then. So that's good. Uh, double sleeving is you got to be very careful with. Once the sleeves are like that, they don't come. Okay, so then we say like um. Okay, we can we can present our findings now to the, to them. So. Assuming not considering other factors, it's better to upstart first. We can do the math on this. Uh, but it, assume that it is better. We do the math. Let's assume that we have ten cards in our deck. This works with any deck size, but ten is easy. If we upstart, then duality. We we are basically looking at the top four cards of our deck and hoping Raigeki is in there. That's a 40% chance. That's a 40% chance. If on the other hand, if we activated duality first, we would have a 30% chance of finding the Raigeki from the duality. Yeah, we have a forty percent chance from the duality. Uh, at first glance, it may seem like Okay. Then, if we don't find a Raigeki, okay. this happens 70% of the time in this scenario. We activate upstart 
for a 10% chance to find one. However, since this scenario only occurs 70% of the time, we have to multiply 10% by 70%. Which gives us an extra 7% for a total of 37%. Therefore, in a 10 card deck, you lose about 3% by activating duality first. However, now with this knowledge, Anything else we should add to this explanation? Assuming that we are not considering other factors, it's better to upstart first. We can do the math on this. Let's assume we have 10 cards in our deck. This works with any deck size, but 10 is easy for math. If we upstart, then duality. Go to the prestigious event question and fix every to ever. Oops. Thank you. Let's say that we have 10 cards in our deck. This works with any deck size, but 10 is easy for math. If we upstart then duality, we are basically looking at the top four cards of our deck and hoping Raigeki is there. That's a 40% chance. If we activate duality first, then we would have a 30% chance of finding the Raigeki from the duality. If we activate duality first, we would have a 30% chance of finding the Raigeki from the duality. Then, if we don't find a Raigeki, this happens 70% of the time in this scenario, we would activate the upstart for a 10% chance to find one. However, since this scenario only occurs 70% of the time, we have to multiply 10% by 70%, which gives us an extra 7% for a total of 37%. Therefore, in a 10 card deck, you lose about 3% by activating duality first. However, comma, if we are considering outside factors, Let's use Droll, Droll and Lock Bird as an example. Then, and assuming Raigeki is our out to win the game, It would make sense to activate duality first. If If what? Okay, we can actually do the math on this, but it's pretty difficult. How sure, if we're like 20% sure they have a droll, would we activate duality first? We can do the math on this, actually. So, okay, we have four cases, right? Do a little notepad here. We have four cases. We have Yestrel, Upstart, Yestrel, Duality, No Droll, Upstart, No Droll, Duality, right? So if we have, if they have Droll and don't have Upstart, If they have drill and we upstart, we have a 10% chance. 
If they have Drill and Weak Duality first, we have a 30% chance. And if they no Drill, Upstart first, we have 30 or 40% chance. And then if they have no Drill Duality, we have 37%. Okay, let's do something like this here. Activate, activate. Isn't the easy answer just saying upstart leaves you with three cards in deck and then duality lets you see everything? Right, if you only have four cards in your deck, Yes, if you have four cards in your deck, the example is even more obvious. It's a good point, actually. If you have four cards in your deck, then yes, obvious. Oh, it does. You have four cards in your deck. Oh my god, I didn't even read that. <sighs> four cards in our deck. Tunnel vision. <laughs> true, true tunnel vision. I wanted the question to be more complicated so that I could, I could give a better answer. But now it's too obvious. Fuck. The 75% chance of finding the right Geki from the body. Then if we don't find our Geki, this happens 25% of the time. We activate Upstart for a 25% chance to find one. No, actually, I, I lied. For a 33% chance to find one. I did the math wrong the first time. We only have three cards left in our deck now. We have three cards left in the deck now. However, since this scenario only occurs 25% of the time, we have to multiply 25% by 33%. What's 25 times 33? 25 times 33. 8.25% gives us an extra 8.25. Wait, 25 times 33, oh no, 0.25 times 0.3, 0.25 times 0.33, yeah, 8%. For a total of 75 plus 8.25, what is that? That's 80 plus 3.25, 83.25? You lose about 17, 16.75%. Are these numbers right? Do these numbers make sense, chat? I think these make more sense now. If, okay, let's go back to this then. If you, guys, if you guys think that math is right, let's go back to this then. But I'll let you guys check my work here. Yes, Droll, activate Upstart first is one and four. Yes, Droll, activate Duality first 
is 75%. No droll, activate upstart first. Um, is 100%. No droll, activate. Activate duality first is 83.25%. Okay. So, okay, the math here is, let's call this A, B, C, and D then. A, B, C, and D. These are three scenarios here. Um, so it's we have a variable which is called percent droll. We'll call percent droll just P. Probability equals probability that opponent has droll. All right, so then our formula would be uh, we have two formulas, the expected value if we activate upstart first, right? So expected value if we activate upstart first, P, so this happens with some percentage and we get uh, upstart first. Uh, plus one minus P. So it's the probability times a times a probability that we don't get it and we activate upstart first, which is times C right so upstart first and then duality is this times b plus one minus p times d i don't know if this makes any sense to you guys it's making sense here am i spitting some formulas here So this is equal to A times P uh, plus C minus C times P, right? A times P plus C minus C times Actually, we can just do the math here. Let's not do the math. Let's plug it in, right? Let's plug it in. So P times A is P times 0 0.2, P times 0 0.25 plus one minus P times uh, C. So C is 100, right? So it's actually just plus one minus P. Plus one, because it's 100. 100 minus P is still P.
So P times 0.25, this is our final formula. And then the formula down here is P times 0.8325 plus plus um, times D, D is, oh no, B is 75, whoops, plus one minus P times, uh, times D, D which is 83.25. Or 0.8325. So now if we set this and this equal to each other, we should be able to find the value of P where there's a breaking point here. Right, so let's get all the p's to one side. We have, oh, this is so complicated, this math. Should I just give up on this math or should I finish it? I'm almost there, but this math is too crazy. It's probably easier if I write it down, but I don't have that luxury. This is actually 0.8325. We can factor this in minus 0.8325p. Okay, so we take this out. And this is 0.75p. Let's make this a little bit neater. Okay. We have 0.25 and one, okay, so we have 0.8325p, let's add it over here. Actually, so this minus this. First, we can subtract these two from each other, right? 0.75 minus 0 0.8325. 0 0.75 minus 0.8325 is 0 0.0825. Uh, whoops. This is actually 0 0.08325. Negative. Negative 0 0.08325, which we're gonna add 0 0.08325 to here, to the other side, which is um, okay, well, let's, let's, let's go back here. We have this and this, and we want to subtract this from the one here. So this is, and this is 1.25 minus P. 1.25 minus P equals plus 0.8325. Okay, like this. This is our new equation, right? After we've done some simplification. Simplify, and then we can add. If we subtract 0.8325 or 0 0.8325, oh my God, dude, this math, I'm, this is too much. Oh, this is too much math for me. If we subtract 0.8325 from 1.25, we get 0 0.4175. 0 0.4175. We take this, we can subtract it. So 0 0.4175. And 
then we subtract it here from here. Now we need to add this to this, which is a negative. So it's one we're adding, and this will be a negative version. So one minus 0 0.0832. 1 minus 0 0.0832 is 91.68. Okay. 91.68. 0.9168p. So then it's just this divided by this. And we get our breakpoint value, I think. 0.4175. Divided by point nine, uh, point nine one six eight. We get forty five point five five. It's some number like this forty five and a half percent, which means P equals roughly forty five and a half percent the break point. 45.5% is the break point for P. <laughs> Meaning that if we thought that uh, meaning that if we thought that our opponent had more than a 45.5% chance of having droll in their hand then we should actually duality first. Otherwise, it is still better to have upstart. This math doesn't seem right, but I'll double check it. This math seems off to me for some reason. Mm -hmm. We have this and this, which is 0.25p plus 1 minus p, which seems right, and 0.75 plus 1 minus p times 0.8325, which means we have this, 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 this equals 0.75 plus 0.8325 minus 0.35p. Now this seems right. Then we do some simplification here. Oh. No, this is not quite right. Shit. Shit. Math is not quite. Hey, Nick, how's it going? I'm trying to answer some Farfa questions to be their third wheel Farfa on MBT questions. The math isn't quite right here. This actually is. Oh, I fucked this up. This is 0.25p plus 1 minus p equals 0.75p minus 0.8325p, which is 
negative this plus this. And then 0.25p minus p is negative 0.75p, actually. Negative 0.75, actually. So like this. So my math is wrong. Doesn't surprise me. This is actually like this plus one minus p equals 0.75 p minus this. Yeah, 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 this makes more sense. Did you get an invite for the invitational? I did, so I will be playing. I will be playing in the invitational. Okay, so more math. 0.75. Minus 0.8325. Oh, I see. Minus 0.08325. Whoops, sorry. Ooh, sorry about that. Yeah, we get um this, which is 0.66675, actually. So I did the math wrong. 0.66675p. 66675p. And 1 minus 0.8325. 1 minus point like this. This makes more sense to me. Okay. Point one six seven five. One six seven five. Yeah, that makes sense. Then if we divide this by that, point one six seven five divided by point six 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 seven five. This is one of their questions. I'm just giving a big brain answer. No, this is not one of their questions. I'm just giving, I'm just elaborating on the answer here. 25% is about 25%. P equals this. P equals this. Percent. P is roughly 25%. This means that, get rid of this. If we thought our opponent had a had more than 25% chance of having Droll in their hand, then we should activate duality first. Otherwise, it's still better to upstart. Case B, case C, case D. Okay, let's put this in our answer then. Our opponent had more than a one in four chance of having Droll in their hand. A layer of dankness recently? Did they email you or something? I haven't checked my email recently. I was going to do that after the stream.
I'm sorry if neither of you like it. I have not though, Nick. I haven't been contacted by the guy. Unless, I mean, I can check real quick actually. Meet the Duelist podcast? Ooh, that sounds fun. Okay, I'll check it out then. I'll check my email. I'll definitely check my emails then. I haven't checked my email, which I need to do. How funny would you say you are for content creation purposes? <laughs> Let's just say you don't need to be worried if you think Yu-Gi-Oh! the abridged series is funny please close the form now wait that's that is funny though what the heck that is funny bro these guys are mean Oh, thank you for reminding me that. Thank you for reminding me that, Nick. Let's just link that combo tutorial video. Man, Yu-Gi-Oh! Yu-Gi-Oh! Toss is so funny, dude. Uh, wait, where is this video? Here we go. Your resident Grand Modular expert. Oh, have you guys seen this video? It's pretty funny. Ishan, how do you do Grand Modular combos? And so I figured I'd make a quick combo video for you guys, as the combos can get a little hairy and a little complicated. So let's go on to the first combo. Okay, first combo is actually a one card combo. You just need one starter, and this starter is Pot of Desire. Okay, and this one is a little susceptible to hand traps, but you know, can't worry about hand traps for our entire life now, can we? Okay, so first you're gonna wanna activate Pot of Desires, right? Important step, have to start with Pot of Desires. Okay, then you're gonna wanna banish the top 10 cards of your deck face down. So that's five, two, three, four, five, that's 10. Okay, now as you've paid the cost for Pot of Desires, the next part of the combo is the most skill testing part of the combo. And this is the most important part of the combo and it takes a lot of skills, so pay attention. So the first thing you wanna do is you're gonna draw Eater of Millions. Okay, so boom, finish that. Next thing you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna draw Grand Modular Daizu. Okay, so <laughs> I know this combo is a little bit difficult, but once you're at this step, the pot of dive will be in your graveyard. You'll have 10 cards banished. Okay, and now the combo diverges a little bit. This is where you have some player preference here. You could either go, okay, this is a little bit complicated, but, but stay with me here. You could either go normal summon Gren, okay, and then take your whole extra deck, throw it over here, and then special summon Eater, attack for game. Or sometimes what I prefer to do is I actually prefer to first throw my whole extra deck over here and then normal special summon <laughs> eater and then normal summon grand. So there you go, guys. I know that one's a little complicated, but I hope that this one will help you guys. That is the one card of Pot of Desires, Grand Module Combo. Okay, so let's go to the second combo. Zodiac Module Deck. Okay, guys. So you pull it together? Oh, that's pretty cool. Say, well, Keishan, what if I, I didn't play it today. Game? I played Lyrilis Tri Brigade. Okay. But that's, I'm glad you found some success with it. You know, then what are you gonna do? And as I say, well, you just have to open a better hand so you can play around hand traps, okay? And the way to do this to play around Ash is you actually wanna open Pot of Desires, Eater of Millions, and Grand Maju, okay? So in this case, you play around Ash easily, right? So this is the combo where you play around Ash. Of course, you activate Pot of Desires, 
Okay, they got one, two, three, 20 and one. That's crazy. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. That's crazy. Dash, you know, you say no worries. Uh, okay. And then again, you have a really important decision here. Do you want a normal summon grand first and then put your whole extra deck over here and then special eater? Or do you want a special eater first and then normal grand? I'm going to leave that one up to you guys. It really depends on the situation and it can really make quite a big difference. So you got to analyze the game state before you do that. Okay. So that's combo two replacing that Nash. All right. Combo three. Let's go to combo three now. All right, guys, so here we are with combo three. Now, combo three, as you can see, we're in a bad situation. Our life points are low. Um, now, a lot of players ask me, well, how do you get out of a losing situation, Ishan? And uh, the, actually, the answer is really, really simple. Um, you just want to do this combo when you're in a losing situation. Let me bring back some water, water real quick, guys. No problem. Okay, so first thing you want to do is you want to enter your draw phase and top deck Grand Maju. Right, you've got your fat stack of banished cards after a long game. Uh, this Grand Maju is going to be, you know, more than 12,000 attack, right? Okay, now when you proceed to standby phase, you actually will need to remember to take your Golden Castle Stromberg and send it to the graveyard because you don't even have 10 cards left in your deck. Okay, so that's an important step two to remember that combo. Remember step one, draw the Grand Maju. Step two in the standby phase, destroy the Golden Castle. Okay, now you want to go to step three, which is to move to your main phase. Okay, and then you're going to want to normal summon Grand Maju. That's step four. Uh, and then you're going to want to enter battle phase. That's step five. And then you're going to want to attack for game. That's step six. So I know this is a pretty complex combo six steps um but you know it helps me win a lot of games and so if you can master it you'll be able to win a lot of games too well all right guys i hope you guys enjoyed the combo video i hope you guys found it informative and i will see you guys in the next video Hello guys, the DB Grinder here, back at it again with another video, and this time we have Like a Boss 22, 706 rating versus Young Trishula with 1105 rating, so it's going to be another high rated DB video. And oh shit, we got to a DB Grinder video after. Alright, I'm back. Let's go back to this then. Um, Have you guys seen Happy Gilmore by the way? I thought that was a pretty funny movie. I don't know. I watched it when I was a kid. I, I that one sticks out to me as a funny movie since I was a kid. Okay, let's go next. What hobbies do you have outside of the Yu-Gi-Oh trading card game? Question. Um, what achievement? When did I last start? This is actually a good question. Uh, before I started streaming. Actually, when did I start streaming? I've been streaming for three hours and 29 minutes. I showered about 30 minutes before I started streaming. I am, I am now three hours and 3.5 hours into my stream. So I would say about four hours ago. Champagne and cocaine. What hobbies do I have outside of Yu-Gi-Oh trading card game? That is a good question. Um, I like to program. I like to make program. I like to write programs. Programs for random things I need. I like to write programs for random things. I like to play other games. Besides Yu Gi Oh! Of course. No, I like watching sports. Water polo knife. 
Tell them how I'm a baller on the weekends. <laughs> yeah, I just, I go, I go to the local bar, bro. That's my hobby. I go to the bar, bro. Hey, I pick up the chicks, bro. You know how it is. I, I whip out my grand shoes. I'm like, hey, girl, you see these? It works every time. Honestly, it works every time. It works every time. Works every time. Pop your collar. Oh, whoops. Like this. The chicks at the bar say I have the biggest deck. <laughs> what achievement outside of Yu Gi Oh are you most proud of? That's a good question. <laughs> I never thought about that before. Inside Yu-Gi-Oh, it's pretty easy. Outside Yu-Gi-Oh, what's my greatest achievement? Graduating? I mean, I would say graduating uh graduating around covid and being able to f get a programming job i know that seems basic but i am extremely thankful for the security it provides as especially since I know many lost their jobs due to the virus. Graduating. All right, see you, Nick. Appreciate it, especially. I guess COVID is spelled like this, huh? Let's go next. Fuck is player B? Bonus question, submit a video application. Oh, I do, I actually, I do like to cook. I also really, really like to cook. Recently been cooking Chinese food. It's been going pretty well. It's been going pretty well. Actually, I almost forgot I like to cook, Patrick. I swear. <laughs> I actually, no, I've been cooking a lot of Chinese food recently. It's been good. It's been good, actually. Why did they put this video thing at the end, bro? I should have looked through all the questions first. I mean, like, damn. It just told me I would have made a whole video out of this thing. Playing chess. I like to play other games besides Yu-Gi-Oh! Like chess. And... Okay, let's just say other game outside you go. There's too many games. Bro, hire me as your manager. I should hire you as my manager. What is player B? Is it like player A, B, and C? Player uh Konami 3v3 dual rules. <laughs> player A. Oh, this is not it, dude. Uh, this is some stuff. What is player A, B, and C? That's just like the order you sit in, right? And you can like... 
I have played MTG before. I'm just going to say yes. I have no idea. I'll answer this one later. You couldn't have put this first. So I know I knew to make. Seriously? Seriously? When are they reading these on stream? What's the due date? I could make a video for this. Seriously? I would call them out. You couldn't? have made this the first question? How about that? What do you guys think about that? How's that for an answer? <laughs> now I got to the end and all my reactions will be fake. Just like your freaking ban list reaction bit. Seriously? Seriously? Oh, also I need to put a link here. Fucking god damn it, bro. Fuck these guys, bro. Seriously. I might as well Rick roll him at the fucking end of all this. What? This is... What? Why does it say nice link? Oh, I can't... I can't put a... F I can't put anything here? Seriously? Oh my god, dude. Wait, maybe I can put that first. Ah. Wait, I can't put this last? I'm trying to trick Google here, but it won't let me. Uh, I have to put the link first. Damn. Fuck.
Okay, is this good enough? How about like this? We just put the link there. We don't even say it's your video, we just say it's a link. Like this. <laughs> well, no, Google is doing the right thing. They, they are trying to enforce you to have a link, although they're not looking for links inside this entire string. They're only looking at the beginning, which maybe is intended, I'm not sure. Username on YouTube is Ishan. You can contact me at. I'll do the contact later. I'll do the contact later. Uh, just because I don't want to show the whole thing on stream, if that makes if that makes sense to you guys, <laughs> I don't want to do the entire thing on. Um. Okay, let's go back here. Let's, should we reread everything? Oh, I'm gonna do my. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna upload a quick. Or I'm gonna. Here is a ten second video of my setup. Yu Gi Oh! Italian Yu Gi Oh! GX theme? I don't even. I've never even seen that. Italian Yu Gi Oh! GX. Italian Yu Gi Oh! GX theme. This thing? Yu Gi Oh! Yu Gi Oh! Is your life just a game? Yu Gi Oh! Yu Gi Oh! <laughs> And this is pretty hard, bro. Like, this is pretty good, actually. Alright, enough of this. I'm trying to finish this up here. All right, I'm gonna need you guys all to say hi to Farfun MBT when I record this video here. Damn, I need to stand up, bro. My fucking... I should use my standing desk more, what the hell? I have a fucking standing desk for this reason. My desk goes up. Look at that, isn't that cool? I sit too much, I need to stand more. All right, I'm gonna record something real quick, guys. Oh my god, I have to enter my password. Okay. Everyone say hi to Farfun MBT. Say hi, say hi, say hi. Say hi. All right, let's record this like this first. Hi Farfa, hi MBT. I'm doing your stupid form right now. Um, here is a video of my setup I was streaming right now. Here's my computer. Here's a nice view of my microphone. Here's a nice view of my arm stand. Here's a nice view of my mechanical keyboard. Gotta be mechanical. And here's a chat saying hi to you guys. All right. <laughs> Perfect. Okay, let's do 25 second video. 
Time to upload this to YouTube, boys. Do I have YouTube app on here? Where's my YouTube app? I don't have YouTube on here? That's wild, bro. Delete. Okay, perfect. I'm gonna upload this video then, and then we're almost done, basically. Uh, I don't have a YouTube app somehow, which is crazy. This is my other phone. I use it like randomly. I'm using my main phone for um for um what's it called the camera right now. So yeah, man, I need to stand. Um, I need really need to stand up more. This is crazy. Sitting down too much all day. Gotta stretch. Ugh, stretch it out. Download takes forever, bro. I'm just gonna upload a goddamn video. Christ. Christ. Alright, I guess it's proofreading time then. It's proofreading time so that we can set it all up at the end correctly. Right? It's proofreading time. Okay. Do you have a mic and set up? Far wow, look at these look at these guys. Farfa and MBT have full ownership of the content you create during the event. There's no way this is legally binding, but it's funny. There's no way this is legally binding, though. You could, you could probably argue this in court, I'm almost certain. First of all, it doesn't say that... <laughs> it doesn't even say that they have to pick you for this contract to be legally binding. That means if you... <laughs> if you record anything during the event, even if you're not picked and you fill out this form, that means they still own the content? I don't think that's what they intended, but that's what they said. And I, I don't think that you could say that you're getting some, this contract would be legally binding in that case. Then you could say the whole contract is illegal. And then the contract would be legally binding. Crazy, bro. There's no way this is legally binding. I'll, I'll ask him about it, but there's n there is no way, right? Like, I could see, like, if they select you to participate, that it could be legally binding. <laughs> Clarify content, right. Like, there's no way this is legally binding. Like, it's too general for any, like, if I broke this, I'm like, fuck you guys, I'm gonna upload whatever I want, you know? Like, <laughs> like I don't think they could do anything. <laughs> With this, this is crazy. Okay, let's let's read. I just did, I didn't even read this the first time. Do you have a mic and setup suitable for a three video tournament? And do you know how to use the Loom Book? Provide an image if possible. Yes, I have a Blue Idiot a mic stand, so you know I'm a professional you get content creator. By the time you read this, I will also make ten dollars from YouTube. I freely play on Dueling Book. In fact, I call it can call a judge with my eyes closed. Here's one eight five six video of my setup. Okay. However, it takes everyone's content. Yes, although I will say Farve takes content in a way that I'm, I'm like, I'm happy to see it because like, he actually edits it and makes like opportune posts and there's like some story he's telling with content that he takes. Whereas like sometimes people are just literally re-uploading someone else's content with nothing. That's like crazy, right? Like if you're gonna take someone else's content, it needs to be in. Like service of your own content, which I think he does a good job of, so you know, I'm okay with it. I'm sure if you asked him never to use your content, he wouldn't use it. Like, I don't think he would fight that. But I don't see any problem with the way he uses people's content. Yeah, I think that's probably, I don't, I don't know anything about law. If MBT's actually a law student, he probably knows a little bit more. I'm sure MBT knows this isn't legally binding, but it's nice to put it up here so you don't have an argument later about what people are getting themselves into. Most of the times you don't need legally binding contracts for something like this. There's not really any money involved or anything. Well, since both of you guys, even though you dislike Grand Maju, it would only make sense that I would be the third member so that you, 
so that you are guaranteed not to play me. That way, peace, balance, and order restore in the world. Also, you guys farmed my single plays YC at spoiling Grand Maju deck for content. At least you could do is throw me a bone. I like that. Oh, I have to provide a fucking sample deck list. <laughs> Bro, every time he makes a Grand Maju video, he always complains about how easy the deck is to play. Like, it's like brainless, basically, is what he says. I, I, I don't know if that's a... I, that seems like a negative thing, right? I feel like this deck is brainless. Are you saying that's a negative thing? Or is that a pot? Maybe it's a positive thing. I don't know. Shit. Far, didn't Farfa make that comment once? Is like, I hate everybody, but Grandma... I hate... Like, I love everybody except Grand Maju players. Like, I think... Anyway, I'm sure it'll be fine. Uh... Okay. Decklist. Let's pull out a Grand Maju decklist real quick. Well, he was just like I said. He like I said. He he farmed me for content. I'm just asking for a little bit in return. That's all I'm asking, right? That's all I'm asking. <laughs> No, it's fine. I was happy that they farmed me for content. They farming me for content is part of the reason why I have a thousand subscribers today. Like seriously. That's probably a reason why. It's, it's a symbiotic relationship. I'm just asking for a little bit more. Symbiosis. I want a little bit more. Um, let's go take a look at Grand Maju here. I have like some cards. I don't even know if this is a deck. Oh, I think this is a good deck. I was going to try something like this next event. But I don't know if Numerons are good. I might, I might just put Droll in the extra. Droll or Lancia? I don't know. It's all the same to me. Probably just Droll, to be honest. Droll seems slightly better. Um... And I, I'll just put a fucking unicorn in the extra. I don't know, dude. It doesn't really matter. It's just a deck list. Just a sample deck list. Just make something up here. Too bricky. Oh, I can just link them. You're, you're right. You're right. You're right. I can just link them a freaking deck profile. Why would I? Yeah, good point. Good point. Man, Patrick, you really should be my manager. This is not as much dirty. I had three danger Bigfoot, three thinner ton, three. Here. If they really want to watch this shit, they can, hey guys, bro. It's e I wasn't using a good mic in this video, but hey, whatever. This is because I just got my mic, or before I got my mic. Um. Uh, I made a whole. I like that. I like this. I'm not even 100% sure the math is right. Add that there. Add that there. Okay, is my YouTube app finished downloading? Upload a video real quick here. It's, oh, it is finished downloading. Okay, let's open it up then. I upload the video from this phone. I'll make it private, I guess. I should have changed the stream title a while ago. Oh well, be late now. Sign in with Google. Okay. Oh, it's gonna ask for two-factor authentication because I do two-factor authentication, right? Okay, well, it's better than getting your account hacked, I guess.
Enter the password. What's the password? YouTube account. Honestly, I haven't logged into my YouTube account in so long. It's like, it's all logged in on all my devices, right? So like, I don't even know what my password is. A password. Open the Gmail app on my iPhone. Okay, I gotta take, I gotta move the camera for a bit, boys. Sorry. Gotta do my two-factor authentication here. Yes, it's me trying to sign in. Okay. Nice. Damn, bro, I spent so much time on this application. Like, why did I spend so much time on this shit? Oh my god. Why did I spend so I have no absolute. It's back, boys. It's back. Oh, there's my computer. You guys can see my. I built it myself, actually. I would recommend it. Okay. Uh, so I want to upload something here. How do I upload something on the phone? I don't usually do this either. That's notifications. I want, to, oh, dude, shh. holy fuck. How do I upload? YouTube Studio Gate. Is there a way to upload from the app? Maybe I can upload from my videos app? I have no clue, to be honest, guys. I have no clue. Here's my video. How you could upload from YouTube? Oh my, okay, hold on a second. I need to be on Do Not Disturb. Stupid. Your channel, YouTube studio, what? Upload videos on YouTube app. Tap the video upload at the bottom of the screen. But I don't have that, bro. I don't have that. They really get rid of the thing to upload videos from the app? Seriously, guys? Why would they do that? Oh, here we go. It's on the bottom. It's on the plus side now. They just changed it. Okay, we got it, boys. We got it. We got it. We got it. Hi, Farfa. Hi, MBT. I'm do Set up. Okay, it's uploading now. Hopefully this doesn't lag the shit out of my stream. It's only 25 seconds though, so it shouldn't. Okay guys, I think that's it then. I think we filled out the whole application. I think that's it. So... I appreciate everyone coming in to watch today. I guess that's gonna be it for the stream then. I'll see you guys next time I stream. It was a long ass stream today. I've never streamed for four hours, holy crap. That's like one of my longer streams. It was fun. I appreciate uh I appreciate everyone coming in. It was pretty cool. Um Yeah. So hey yeah, peace out guys. Thanks for tuning in everybody. I really appreciate it. If you haven't subscribed, subscribe already, blah blah blah, all that good stuff. 
Um, it was fun. Have a good night. And I will